I'm here with my girl Shayla Ishere. Okay, Shayla Ishere. Okay, hello, hello. Shayla Ishere. Okay, homeboy, right out the gate, we got a watermelon. Okay, this is fresh. Feel that. Okay, don't get fresh in that. And we got these little mini bottles of wine. Okay, do you see something that can that we can make work? Okay. We're doing a wine-infused watermelon right out the gate. Yummy. Now, it's going to take a little while for this wine to seep in. So, we can do it, then set it aside. Then, towards the end of the show, we'll go back, look at it, see how much sucked in. Let Shayla take a little sip, okay? Now, right out the gate, what I want to do. Oh, by the way, okay, hold on. We got a bunch of news to cover. As we speak, as we speak, the feds are raiding Diddy right now, okay? They're probably still in handcuffs right now so we can do this and then we can do a little talk about that okay all you diddy fans okay i know a lot of y'all on the edge you all see because that's your hero you all hang in there okay hang in there <laughs> <laughs> diddy he's my hero diddy or did he don't i don't know okay <laughs> <laughs> so we got our little whites in right we can open this up shelly want to taste this to see how you like this huh sure okay What was all that? <laughs> it was actually really good. You like that? I'm not really a wine girly, but yeah. Okay, so you can... Why Zinfandel? That's so you can handle this. Okay, so guys, yeah. what I doing? Hold the camera for me, okay? I, I'm marking... I'm marking this watermelon with this little pen here. With, sorry, with this little cap. Listen to me, pen. Okay? I'm using the cap like a pen to cut holes in, okay? So I'm mapping where these holes need to go. So another one there, and another one there. <coughs> Zach H just became a member. What's up? What's up, Zach? Oh Thanks boy! Thanks for becoming a member again. Welcome Thanks for the party. So okay. Oh, go wide for a second. Let me just tell these things, my boys. One more thing. Okay, guys. The main feed is YouTube. Okay. We do share out to Facebook. The Facebook feed gets shut down all the time. The episodes don't stay there. Okay. They really on YouTube. So if there's something you saw before and you want to rewatch it, <laughs> can't do it on Facebook. You got to do it on YouTube. Okay. Come over to YouTube. Become a member, all right? Because we could use your money to buy alcohol and also you can make donations for more alcohol, okay? Okay? We need as many booze as we can get. <laughs> okay. Yeah. It's a call for booze. <laughs> okay. Hold that up again. Let me just show oh, you. Oh, hello, Mr. Strong. Mr. Hi, Strong. Mr. PhD. Suppose we find out that he is not a PhD. Huh? That'd be very interesting. Huh? It's just an interesting clue. Dude catfished us the whole time, okay? <laughs> we got catfished, okay? Does the liquor store ever get sick of seeing you, or are you like their favorite person? No, they didn't know me. They, 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 what do you mean? <laughs> like, you think they can be upset of seeing me? Hell no. They're like, oh my gosh, here's Sky again. Any store within, within five miles of this place, ten miles, I should say. Ten? Within ten miles of here knows me for coming in because they never all have the same thing. I got to go to this one for this, this one for that, that one for the next, you know what I mean? Did you tell them they all need to put everything together so you can just do a one-stop? Yeah, but they, it, ain't, it ain't really up to them. The, own, shop. The, the owner's never around, homeboy. It's, I work with the lowly guys, you know? Aww. The dudes who are just trying to pay their bills. Mm. Who really ain't got time for my shit. <laughs> <laughs> we have people watching from all over the world. We have Saudi Arabia in the Saudi house. Arabia in the house! What's up? Hi. We have South Africa, we have Pakistan. Oh boy, Hi, one day. One, one day. And Jason just became a member. Thanks, Thank you, Jason. Jason. Thank one you, day, Jason. one day, I can sip a cold one in Saudi Arabia because I could see you all on the way to making alcohol legal, okay? Because you're already letting people drink it now in the, in the private American areas, you know? So don't, don't be surprised. <coughs> it's coming. It's coming. Are you back wider? Okay. Yeah, we're going back close. What should I be doing this year, though? Strawn said, my PhD is real, got it in 2006, homeboy. I believe you, Strawn, I believe you. We can verify that at some point, okay? Some point we can need some verification, <laughs> okay? <laughs> Daryl wants to know both of our names. Who, Vero? This bald dude right here with the black t-shirt. I'm sorry, why do you have to describe me as bald? His name is Sky with two Y's. Okay. Like the vodka. And my name is Shayla. This little psycho in the corner here holding the camera, that's Shayla. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't call you psycho. I just only stated true facts about you. Yeah, but you emphasized the bald part, you know? It wasn't even like you were saying bald. You were like, this bald bitch was what you really wanted to say. Okay. <laughs> 
How dare you refer to me as a bald bitch? <laughs> I refer to you as a bald bitch. <laughs> you implied it though. Oh, okay. She implied it. Zach H got his PhD yesterday. Congrats, Congratulations, Zach. Zach. <laughs> Welcome he, to your party. He got his PhD yesterday. He became a member today. Okay, okay, homeboy. So check this out now. So I got my little wine here. And I come in and I shove it in like that, okay? Wow. See that? Can I do the next one? Okay, do the next one on top. Let's turn, let's turn the labels up. Hold on, now. hold tight. Go ahead. What you want to do? Shove it in really quick? Hold on, but turn it, turn it so we can see the label, label forward. Label forward, right? Like that? But, but you gotta tilt the, you gotta yeah. tilt. Did I do it right? We get it in, get it all the way in. Stop it in. We got our first super chance. Thank, you thank, you, thank you, thank you, thank you. From Mirror Domains. Got to know how to handle the blade, boys. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. That's the serial killer right there. <laughs> He's like, Sky, you got to know. You know what I mean? <sighs> what's, your, what's your weapon of choice? Yeah, probably a club. A club? It's kind of dude beat you to death. Hey, Arkansas. <laughs> what's up? I think mine would be that hammer that you have in that drawer right okay, there. Okay, hold that, hold that like that. Hold you want to like be that. my first victim? Hold on. Whenever, whenever, I, whenever I hear Arkansas, I remember the kid. Who took my light off? Hey Arkansas, hey Arkansas, hey Arkansas, hey Arkansas. Hi Isaiah, hi Gerard, hi Darth, hi everybody, hi Rightway. How are you guys doing? Thanks, Rightway. This is a gift we got in the mail from Arkansas. Though. Thank you, Beryl. Yeah. Thanks, okay. Arkansas. She sent us this uh, that candle. Our mailing address is on there, guys. So if you want to send me some booze, like all y'all, like Sky, do you have a bottle of some exotic shit that you know I don't have because the only one in existence and your granddaddy have it? You can send that to me, okay? Yeah. Hope I'm not. Don't let your granddaddy know that you can be pissed. So I was one, so one of these dudes. Send me some rare bottle that granddaddy have. I use it in some fucked up jungle juice. <laughs> and then we found out the shit worth a couple hundred grand. And now I, your granddaddy's haunting you. And now he's now no now he's suing me. Okay? Open this About one. This? Yeah. Everybody loves your outfit today, Shayla. Oh, thank you guys. She got a lot of confidence wearing that, right? That's the same thing I was saying. Right here. Uh -huh. <laughs> well then. Oh wow, this is really interesting. Concoction. Okay guys, okay guys, check that out. Okay, Seven, you could come back to Seven. Okay guys, so you could see, you could just go around. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a horror movie, okay? <laughs> Thank you, Arkansas. I can't tell if she hates me. some notes serious. there, I see. Okay, hold on now. Let's wipe this down. Hi, Bernard. Hold up for a second. How are you? Thanks for tuning in again. Hold up for a second. Hey, I need a fish. Yeah, what outfit? <laughs> <laughs> I need a fish. What outfit? Shelly, you're hot in that jacket, though? No. I'll be Ooh, cold lone if wolf I take in the it house. Off. We got another super chat. Lone Hi, wolf. Lone Wolf. How you doing? How was everybody's weekend? Did we do anything fun over the weekend? You had any dates this weekend, Jayla? No. Really? Mm -mm. You haven't been out with no one this weekend? No guys invited you out? Well, my friend's boyfriend had a birthday party, and so I got dressed up really nice, because you know, I was like, maybe I'll find my husband here. And there was this one guy who kept talking to me all night, but then when I woke up, I saw that he had followed me and then unfollowed me on Instagram, so Damn. I was just like, He's like, that's weird. Probably pictures too hoish or something. Would you think? I don't know. I don't think so. But you really thought he was into me, but I guess not. He's a magician. He followed so. and unfollowed. Yeah, like isn't that weird? Yeah. It's so weird. Isn't Sometimes LA, you can look LA. at a person's pictures and what kind of foolery am I watching? What's up? Hi, <laughs> <laughs> pastry chef. <laughs> pastry chef. You watching Magic Home Boys? So and now we can put this aside. Look at this. Is this the wrong garbage can? This is like yeah, an art piece. We could totally pull this in the lack now. Let me just, I just put propping this up, you know, with these little bottle caps, just to hold everything in place. And let's just put this off to the side, right? What do you say? Oh, 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 oh. Let's, let's put it right here. Actually, let's put it right in the middle. Hi, Shan. Still her friends, no, I would never do that, you guys. See there, see right there. Um, okay then. 
Let's Thanks, Arkansas. We're gonna talk about this in one second. Yes, yes, yes. Oh my gosh. Okay, Arkansas. okay, ladies and gentlemen. Diddy news. Okay, Diddy, Diddy. One more, really quick. Okay. I thought that was. I thought to, this was about to go bad when Shayla said, "When I woke up." <laughs> <laughs> Luckily not. Thanks, Lone Wolf. When you woke up, yeah, Shayla. Um, did he do it or did he not? <laughs> Corny ass man. <laughs> Okay, homeboy. So as we speak right now, oh no, we just did this. We have this. We can put this here, as we as we discuss diddiness. Okay, diddiness. So first things. Okay, let's start with this weekend. Okay, we can get to Monday, but let's start with this weekend. So this weekend, a new term was coined. Yes, it is offensive. Okay, but you can hear a lot of black dudes saying this from now on. Okay. Okay. So the new slang, instead of you know how dudes used to go no homo. Okay. Now they say no diddy. Okay? Wait a minute though. Hold on, hold on, hold on. This is not, that's not just something I just casually pull up my ass. Academics, DJ Academics was interviewing this rapper, right? And the whole interview, whenever he's like, hey, I take care of my boys, you know what I mean? I hook them up, I look after them. They know it's all love with me. No diddy. Right? And he used that no diddy like about 10 times in this interview. And the minute the interview ended, that was it. It stuck. Now no diddy is a thing. Well, you know, I see it all over. Well, after him, it was all over the internet. So again, it is offensive because why are you saying no homo in the first place, huh? Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. But now they've changed that to no diddy, so you should not hear that. Uh, or if you go no homo, it would it would age you because it'd be like, wow, how old are you? You know? Yeah. <laughs> Hi Gilbert. Hi Gilbert. Okay, so that's number one. Number two, I just turned on the news and then I saw this. We got one of them videos that were inside that mansion at the time that DHS or Department oh of Homeland Security made entry uh -huh. into this mansion and onto this property and you saw the juxtaposition of these heavily armed vehicles and those very expensive luxury cars that are parked right so they got some they got some of his sons in right cups there. Oh my so his sons clearly are a, a very different sight than we're used to seeing but uh, there you see some of the people that were inside that mansion uh -huh. at the time of the raid they are being talked to by investigators by people from the Department of Homeland Security I could see they're getting their pictures taken as well so uh -huh. maybe they they don't know uh, so guys with you this know, they're looking for we, you we, see him struggling will it, um, well, well, I mean, he's not fully under arrest. They were just at the house with this raid going on. Maybe, maybe so everybody gets put in cuffs when raids happen. I don't right? know because they would ask you to step aside. So maybe they say something or something like that because it's kind of weird that they're in cuffs. Is it weird that they're in cuffs? Because I like, mean, it depends. Because the kids aren't the ones with lawsuits and stuff against them, right? Like, no, but the guy you said was your friend or uh, that you know. Yeah, he was, was suing Diddy. I think he named the kids in the lawsuit too, right? He's in any event, in any event. He's using them as evidence, but is that, does that mean he's suing them too? I don't know. I mean, if their name's mentioned in a lawsuit, I don't know. But here's the thing with this, guys. This is messy, not as messy, a result messy. of some lawsuit. This was a raid by the feds. Right. And they did, they did Miami and L.A. at the fucking same time. Where's Diddy? I don't know where he is. He could be someplace else. He got multiple homes, but they search his, new, he's, he's they um, search his Miami home and his L.A. home at the same time that means that they really aren't giving you an opportunity to hide anything and they pull up at the I mean, so you gotta understand you coordinating a raid in two states same time on two different coasts yeah you know what i mean so this is this um, some this some heavy shit. Shayla, I, remember the ISIS. I got love for you shayla but are you a member of isis no. what's with the triangle probably i just like triangles really you can leave it at that right in the center there mm -hmm. how um, old were you when you got that like five I'm sorry, how old are you? No, I wasn't five years old. How old are you? It's a beautiful tattoo. Thank you. How old are you? Why does it matter how old I was? Okay, it never mind. You see that? Okay, all right. It does not so, matter how old I sorry, was. Sorry, I'm not even going to ask about that. I like that. triangles. But anyways. Is it one of your favorite tattoos? It's just a triangle. Okay, whatever. Back, back, to, back to Diddy, since she ain't going to fucking answer us, okay? It's just a triangle. For anyway. trafficking, Arkansas? How do you know? Anyway, okay, okay according, according to... Early reports that this is a result of a sex trafficking investigation. Really, I heard that he got into it with those all those liquor companies that he was in business with, and they're probably after him now because of. This ain't got nothing to do with liquor companies. No, this this is this is something heavy from the feds. 
And so this would most likely be an investigation into some something like sex trafficking. So pretty much it's over for Diddy. Now. Not necessarily like, because I mean like who knows? Like maybe maybe he didn't do anything. Maybe he's innocent. We'll see. You know, we have to see what evidence they come up with. But I mean like obviously there's a lot of younger people, um, a couple young, a couple people who would have been underage at the time come forward yeah. saying that he did X, Y, Z. I don't even know if the statute of limitations up on some of those yet. Sex trafficking? But his kids wouldn't be involved with that, right? No, but they don't look, look like they're fully under arrest. They look like they just handcuffed them. Yeah, and that's true, because they would be in the car. Hey, baby, yeah. welcome. So, Thanks so for I, I feel bad for his kids, though, like the boys and the girls, like his daughters and stuff. Mm -hmm. Like, they're probably looking for stuff on the Tupac murder. Maybe Everything. that too. Yeah. But did he? he, has I, a, he but did he no longer have anything in his house from that time? He ain't that yeah. fucking stupid. <laughs> Not like he got the freaking gun sitting there in a frame case. Tupac, you know, Tupac's gun. It's not. It's not gonna be like that. You know what I mean? This is the gun that shot Tupac. No. It's Somebody not like said that. innocent until proven guilty, but I feel like we've been proven many times that that's not how it works. No, but I mean, okay, but just it, because of the press he's you been getting... getting you be guilty to your Yeah, just because innocent. of the press he's getting, everybody assume he's Yeah, guilty. literally, Jack. That's how yeah, I be working in this yeah, country, for yeah, real. Yeah. It ain't about it in this country. It's just the accusations against him. Yeah. There's so many. <laughs> like when I you mean, got that either way, I think either way, Diddy's going to go down. I just feel bad because he has like a very young daughter too. Like, she, no, you know, like, I don't know. His whole family is going to be torn you know apart. Many fucking people in jail with young daughters? Like that excuse. I mean, it's I just feel bad for the kids. It's always the yeah, kids that yeah, end up getting yeah. the short end of the stick. That's yeah. all. For so. the people that just joining, what did we just make? What is this in front of you? Okay, guys, this is a wine infused watermelon that I just made with my lovely Co Can you turn it one more time? Oh. Go ahead. You go ahead. Spin it. Spin it like this. Tiptoe through the window. <laughs> da -da 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 Diamonds are a girl's best friend. It gotta be a horror song. Oh. Go ahead. You know any horror song? Eat er, eat er. I got five on it. <laughs> 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 Messing with that in the wind, I got five on it. That's all I know is that I got five on it part. <laughs> okay, all right. Anyway, homeboy, it's seeping in. This takes time. We can see how far we get. Advice to Diddy, delay, delay, delay. It's working for a rich guy. <laughs> I'm Trump. Thanks for delay the what? Delay what? what okay, but Diddy, Diddy and Trump are too different. Because Trump, could, if Trump becomes delay? president, he could squash all these investigations. <laughs> Diddy ain't making shit go away, okay? <laughs> he, these are in disappearance, son. He in trouble, okay? Any more Diddy news you have, you have to say? How's, you, how's your boy doing? The one? I don't know. I haven't spoken to him. He's like in hiding, so, uh, you know, I'm just praying for him I mean, and his this, family. This next level, like, Diddy got to deal with this before he deal with that dude. Yeah, well. Okay. There's a lot. There's a lot happening with him. So, cool. He's probably gonna be fighting these allegations for the next few years. Who your friend? Did he? Oh yeah. <laughs> what kind of wine is this in there? Oh, this white is Zinfandel. this is white Zinfandel, which is a cheap rosé kind of. They from the same family. Okay, white Zin. You like this? Let's put this one aside now. <laughs> <laughs> there's watermelon seeds getting in it. Yeah, so. watermelon seeds are getting it. A lot of shit can get in it. Yeah. It's a flow back and forth. Okay? It's a it's a it's a flow back and forth. Okay, Shayla. Somebody said in the name of equality, I think Sky should be wearing the same outfit. What the fuck is so she we, wearing? We what is, what is this you wearing anyway? What are you wearing? We have to match tomorrow. What are you wearing? Some kind of bathing suit bullshit? What are you wearing? No, I'm wearing a, a cute Ooh. Top. Why did you get offended when I asked with you about the triangle? With shorts. Why did you get upset when I asked you about the triangle? What? What, what about the question? Because why would you ask me, how old were you? Were you like five when you got it? Okay, you the, the, the five. The You're five, picking I on me. I, I don't appreciate it. I shouldn't have thrown the five in there. How old were you when you got Cheers, it? Cheers, homeboys. This is my latest Thanks, tattoo. Pascal. That's your latest tattoo? Yeah. You have any more triangles? Mm -mm. Just the one. I like the triangle. The triangle's cool. It's the other shit. I'm kidding. All right? To the love between us. Okay, on to the next drink, homeboy. Give me this. Give me this. What? What are they saying now? <laughs> you have to read Zach's last comment. What Zach I'm say? not gonna read it out loud. What did he say? This guy's wearing the same outfit. I think I'd. <laughs> <laughs> I don't blame you, homeboy. <laughs> I get turned on by me too. Okay. 
What are we making? Isaiah says you're wearing an X-Men uniform. <laughs> I'll take it, Isaiah. I will take it. Isaiah, sorry if I butcher your name. Guys, I had to buy this one. She insisted. Buy what? It's the outfit. He ain't buy it. He didn't buy shit. <laughs> he wouldn't even get me my Stanley Cup when I asked him or my snake plant. So don't believe a word he says. Oh boy. They're on the list. They're coming. Thank you. Okay. I really appreciate appreciate you saying that I look like Janet Jackson and not Candace Owens. I appreciate if most of you get your eyes tested so we can stop this shit, okay? Did you see her did you see her um documentary Ooh. on Hulu? Candace? Janet. No. Candace. No. <laughs> Candace. No, I haven't seen it. Okay. Did you see the Candace Owens interview on I think it was Breakfast Club? I know she went in there and she was she was what she brought down the house. They they tested her black card and she failed miserably. <laughs> <laughs> How'd they test it? How'd they test it? Just Hilarious was talking to her and she said, I'm a, she's like, Candace. And Candace was like, yeah. She was like, God is good. And Candace was like, amen. God is good. What, what, and then she said the same thing the, to Charlemagne. What was the correct response? She said the same thing to Charlemagne. She said, Charlemagne, God is good. And Charlemagne said, all the time. <laughs> and then he said, and all the time, God is good. But it's like a staple in African American culture, like church culture. What to say all the time? Yes, you as an automatic chest. response. Sky, would you break the internet with that outfit? I don't know if you that can hold do my it chest. So you my can chest, break the internet. my chest is so muscular. You know what I mean? Thanks, Dave. The huge muscles I have in my chest would bust out of that little shit. I could get you one of these. Okay. Would you ever do an episode where? Can I wear that one? This one's gonna be too small. You need a double XL. I probably. like them small though. Okay. Oh, Girls okay. love to see the abs burst and fall. <laughs> No. Okay, okay, homeboy, homeboy, let's focus on this drink. Hey, do me a favor, grab my ice at the bottom there, okay? Grab my pitcher of ice. And bring that ice bag as well. Do you want this? Huh? Yeah. How many of y'all think Diddy's innocent? Let's go to hell. Don't nobody think he's innocent. <laughs> let's take a poll, okay? Let's take a poll, okay? Did he do it or did he not? <laughs> <laughs> Can you do that? Can the poll say, did he do it? <laughs> Yo, money okay. man in the house. Pull, Thanks for pull, the super chat. Pull. Okay. <laughs> oh, congratulations. That's awesome. Did he poll? I want you know? bets on March Madness. That's awesome. Did he do Congrats, it? Congrats, money man. Thanks for the super chat. Did he not? Okay. Serving poolside. What does that mean? Do I look like I'm in a bathing suit? <clears throat> This don't look like clear ice. It's so funny because it don't be looking like clear ice until you get it wet. And then you can tell it's clear ice. Okay, how's that look? Did he do it or did he not? No, you gotta do diddy, D-I-D-D. Why do it? That's a little much though. Okay, fine. Guys, this is a diddy poll, okay? Did he do it or did he not? Yes. Did okay. he did it? <laughs> did, he, did he did it? <laughs> Innocent and Diddy aren't in the same category. Well then. Like, all right. <laughs> so much. If he's innocent, so is R. Kelly. <laughs> <laughs> you all leave R. Kelly alone, okay? <laughs> Why do you all leave R. Kelly alone? <laughs> when you hear an R. Kelly song now, what do you do? I still listen to it because they hard not to sing though. It's really good. It's catchy music. Yeah. Like you gotta step. Sometimes you gotta separate the artist from the yeah, art. Yeah, I was walking somewhere and I heard someone. I was you know walking down the street. I believe I can fly. And I was like, oh fuck. <laughs> 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 Sorry, my bad. <laughs> that was everybody's graduation song though. I believe I can fly. In the two thousands, <laughs> people can see you can be seen sky in that outfit screaming no. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> the chat's on fire today. No. Diddy is scanning a lot of <laughs> You all leave Diddy alone, man. DDR Kelly, OJ. <laughs> <laughs> they all did it. Oh, okay. okay, all right. How's that look, Shelly? You like that? Yeah, it looks like a drink in a bowl. Yes, okay. That's what we work in the wards, okay? So I'll tell you what we can do. We can come in here, homeboy, and we can hit this with a little bit of ice, okay? We can get some ice in there. How's that look? Looks nice. Okay. Now let's, where's my knife? Your bread knife? No, my, my, my Chinese knife. Where's my Chinese knife? Look in there, look in there. Look at the bottom one. Yes, sir. Thank you. 
what they said. What happened now? I think if I can touch this guy. Wow. <laughs> I believe I can touch the sky. Yeah. Think, Think about, about it every night and day. <laughs> Spread my wings and fly away. Let's not get canceled. I can touch the sky. <laughs> I believe I can soar. Yo, hey, yo, Okay, guys. So check this out. Strong wants to know if this is a fishbowl drink. Yeah, kind of. Kind of fishbowlish. Fish bowlish. You're gonna use all of your clear ice in one drink. Oh, thanks, Street, for giving a membership. Welcome, Dave. Welcome. Thank, you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome to the Tipsy Army. Okay. So we got that there like that, right? Okay. So what I want you to do, guys, looking at this, is let's come out with a little bit of this kind of vodka, uh, tequila. I said that with a little tequila. How much? We're using salsa. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, that's six. good. That's good. That's good. Some triple set? Somebody has a song recommendation. Diddy 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 dum dum. Diddy dum diddy dum dum. <laughs> diddy, diddy, dum, dum. <laughs> oh wow. So Sheila, hold on. So you went on a date this weekend, kind of. I didn't go on a date. What are you talking you about? You met a dude at the party and you were talking. The dude follows you, then he unfollows you. Okay. That's it. That's the end of the story. What do you think happened there? I don't know. I mean, I did get blacked out drunk. Damn. Yeah, that's probably why. <laughs> I blacked all the way out. Don't remember ordering my Uber home or getting home. And I got really, really sick when I got home and threw up everywhere and had to throw out my robe. So you have no idea if you made up with this dude or not? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't make out with anybody. How do you know? Because I don't do that. I don't just make out with random dudes. How I just do you met. know what happened? Huh? How do you know? Because I don't do that. Because I know my character. My friend said I was fine. My friend was there with me the whole time. She okay. was like, Shayla, you're just really flirty. Hey, grab some sweet and sour for us. Ooh, the sweet and sour that we just made. Yeah, guys, this is our homemade sweet and sour. Okay. Let's hit this with some sweet and sour. You should put I, put should I expose who the guy is or no? Is Yo, G Money. Welcome one? to the stream. <laughs> the guy who, the magician. Who, who's hitting on you? <laughs> yeah. Does he have a girlfriend? My or? friend, my friend was okay, like. Go, hold on, did we put in triple sec? No, we didn't. Let's put in a little, a little bit of triple sec. Not much, guys. Quick triple sec. And now let's come behind that with some sweet and sour. Go ahead, pour in some sweet and sour. How much? Just pour some in. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, that's good, that's good, that's good. I don't even know how much that was. This can be on the stronger side, just for the record. Okay. Oh, because the blue carousel too. Yeah. Now we come in behind this, and we can just let our blue run down the bottle, okay? Super chat from David. Thanks, David. What's up, David? It doesn't Sheila, look bad. You dug yourself in the hotel telling your story when you said you were blacked out drunk. <laughs> yeah, but when my blackout is not like other people's blackout. What the fuck you mean it's not like other people's blackout? I carry myself mm -hmm. extremely well. How do you know? Trust me, I know. I've been I've I'm been in this body for 28 years. You have going to on ask someone. You, you have to ask someone. Okay, how did you behave, guys? They come in there with a little straw. And check that out right there, okay? This is our little drink. Now, I can lift this up and pour it in the water. It's my Which I can actually do. Should you do that? Yeah. Which Just I can actually do. Okay, that's good. I think that's perfect. Ooh, that looks nice. Yeah, yeah. right? It's beautiful. <clears throat> By the way, Stephanie is saying, saying uh, I had a party on Friday at my house and the sweet and sour was a hit. <gasps> Right? The sweet and sour was literally so good. Like, you yeah. could just put that over any liquor in a cup with yeah. ice and yeah. and it's perfect. Yeah, dude. So guys, this sweet and sour, this is our own that we made here. It's <coughs> one part of water. Let's just do a cup of each of these, right? A cup of sugar, a cup of water. You boil those two together. Then you add that to a cup of lime juice and a cup of lemon juice, okay? So those three things. Put that in a bottle and you're good, okay? 
<laughs> and you're good to go. All right, ready? Sheila? Okay. What are we calling this? Um. Bambi said, can I get a glass of aviation for me, please? Aviation. An aviation, okay. Ooh, that'd be something fun for me to learn how to make. So that's a classic drink. Oh yeah, the sweet and sour is very, very you like potent. It? Yes, I like it. It's right up my alley. It's tasty, it's really tasty. And I can taste the Smirnoff in there too. And it's not overly sweet, so that's nice. Okay, sweet. <clears throat> what do you want to call this? Blue Lagoon? <laughs> blue Smeary? Smeary Blue? Blue Island Day. Blue Islands. Islands in the stream. Blue Ice Island. That blue is Ice? Happy. I like that, Blue Ice. And this is the Blue Ice. Because it's Smirnoff Ice. Yeah. Okay. Good stuff. Good <laughs> stuff, homeboy. Good stuff. <clears throat> so, all right, let's put that to the side. Let's put these behind us. Hey, Hassan. Welcome to the stream. He says you look like Janet Jackson again. Thank Today, you. Today, everybody thinks you look like Janet Jackson for some reason. Maybe I just need to keep wearing my hair down. <laughs> <laughs> Who is she? Janet what, Jackson. Whatever, whatever, dude, whatever. Stephan, hit me with one of these, okay? So, Jasmine, you have to stop drinking. Thank God my name ain't Jasmine. That was hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> Go one more. Go to the next one. That one had me on the edge of riveting. me and the cleaners okay see you later bye <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> one last one and then we can jump that <laughs> yeah. i'm gonna learn a little party trick grab these bottles like you're grabbing two liquor bottles from the well stack them like this you're going to kick this bottom one. Yeah! You know how to do that one, right? Wow. No, I don't know how to do that. You want to try? It looks scary. Like, I might hurt myself, and I'm not wearing shoes. Do you want to try it? I don't want to try it, to be honest. How? What shoes got to do it with It looks that? hazardous. <laughs> Like it might pinch my fingers or something eee. might happen. See if two, two Modelo in there. Two, two, see if two Modelo's in the fridge. Don't worry, you're not going to do it, sissy. Okay? <laughs> I'm not trying to slice myself open like that. You need to slice yourself open. There is a, there's literally a Corona, a Stella, and a Modelo. There's not two of the same thing, though. And two, uh, bring them close. Which one? Yeah, okay, give me those two. Give me those two. Okay, guys. Do you want uh, me to adjust the camera for you? Huh? Uh, do you want me to adjust? Ah. Uh. <laughs> I don't feel safe. <laughs> well, why the fuck you don't feel safe when you're I 20 feet away? I feel unsafe right now. <laughs> when you're 20 feet away. Okay? I feel unsafe for you. You're 20 feet away, okay? Right. Sky, don't hurt yourself. I'm going to hurt myself, man. Oh, Sky, no. you're my not even wearing shoes. My leg can't bend. <laughs> <laughs> why can't your leg bend? <laughs> You got a stretch. You got a sexy ass laugh. All y'all turned on now, right? Huh? All these dudes in here. Oh my God. I'm so turned on. Wait, huh? Try it. Why can't your leg bend? Do like this. Huh? Do like that. <laughs> oh boy. My legs old. You got to start stretching, man. Okay. My legs been through a lot. Okay. He can't bend his leg to do it. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, 
There we go. Right there like that. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh! I told you you're going to hurt yourself. <laughs> no, I'm not going to hurt myself. You are. I'm not going to fucking hurt myself tonight. <laughs> All right. <laughs> you need shoes on, Sky. I don't need shoes on, homeboy. Are you okay. Kick it. Hold on, watch this. Okay, same principle, okay? Same principle. Same uh. principle. Oh, Sky. Oh, You're not even gonna use one of these beers right now. Huh? I don't, know. You don't can drink waste it. the beer. You can't do it. I can do it, man. The you more, can't believe. The more I tell him he I, he can't do it, the more he tries. <laughs> I need to start using reverse psychology with this man. Yeah, never mind. Okay. <laughs> Next time. <laughs> <laughs> Just have a bottle opener with you, folks. Put no, one. no, no. It's more fun like that. Okay? Put one on your keychain. That way you'll always have one. It'd be better than two of the same bottle, though. Stop. <laughs> <while you're laughs> <laughs> It would be better if it was two of the same freaking bottle, okay? All right? Homeboy? <laughs> Someone say, shake it. <laughs> yeah, that's supposed to help. Scroll after me, scroll after me. RP Sky <laughs> Okay, oh, okay, so guys, you guys, um, okay. Well, firstly, this, this is a really Florida story, but it didn't happen in Florida, okay? So, there was a train accident. Okay, someone accidentally or intentionally, depending, walk in front of a train. So oh. you could tell what happened, right? So they died. The, yes, the person passed away and naturally bodies, parts start Ooh. flying. Yeah. At which point, a California man, okay, which is really where it's in, because it should be Florida man, <laughs> picked up the leg and started walking down the street eating it. Okay? Eating it? Yes, 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 yes. Wait, eating it? Yes, he was eating it, walking down the street, chewing on it. What the? Okay? Dude. Was he homeless? I don't, I mean, I would assume he was homeless, eating on a fucking leg. I don't sound like a dude who have a home would be doing that kind of shit, you know? Did he, did he barbecue it first? He was just eating it raw? He was just eating it raw, detective, yes, eating it raw. What the fuck you think? He took it home and barbecued it and then was eating it? <laughs> no. <laughs> he was walking down the street. Nibbling on the fucking leg. <laughs> so everybody was like, oh my God. That's disgusting. Like, somebody <laughs> says Encino Man. Was that an Encino Man? I, I know Encino. There's, there's a movie called Encino Man with Brandon Frazier and, and, uh, and, yeah. and uh, Paulie Shaw, okay, I think. Okay. Is Encino a, a crazy place? <laughs> no, I mean, not. Florida doesn't claim the story. <laughs> yeah, but that's, that's the guy there. And the, the reason why there's the black circle is because he has the leg in his arm. You know, because people are like, hey, hey, don't do that, man. You know? That's. Yeah, and he's a 27-year-old man as well. 27. Okay? But listen, yeah. most of the homeless people here, a lot of them at least, out of their fucking minds. Yeah, they so. like just did too many drugs and then so, never, I mean, never got... So, I mean, who knows what he saw. Back. Probably saw it like a nice, delicious steak, you know, in his mind. Not realizing, you know, what was going on. You feel me? Where do they just uh, have surfed legs laying around? That's what I'm saying. There was, a there, was a, there, there was someone walked in front of a train. Probably suicide. Walked in front because people do that all the time. We had a waitress. It's quick death, right? Yeah, we had a waitress. Hey, CCP. Do, do you think it's? Thanks for Do you think mean. it's like a painless? I don't know. A train running up and down your ass. I don't know. That don't sound fucking pretty painless to me. But it's super fast. I mean, yeah. You gotta maybe. go to the right place though. Yeah. You can't because go to one of those slow trains. Yeah, because that you might drag go you, and then ugh. you yeah. gotta go to a bullet train. Yeah. Dude, the worst is when you see people who try to off themselves, and then it don't work because there's yeah. a lot of them. So wait, 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 wait! You said a waitress did that? Hey, but one of the waitresses at Barney's, yeah, she walked in front of a train on purpose. Yeah, she was working at Barney's at the time. Yeah, she was it's really she, sad. Yeah, she was an alcoholic, but she had some she had some serious issues. That's really really sad. And you know, and she just was like, "Fuck it," and she she just gave up. You know? Sucks. Yeah, anyway, anyway, so yeah, that, that, that is, he's probably from Florida, just moved to California to pursue acting. <laughs> yeah. Yes, Coulda. yes, Coulda that is that. true. Florida man in California, that's a better name for that story. Florida, Florida man, man in California. California. Arrested for Someone saying probably rehearsing for a role, yeah, okay. <laughs> Doing the walking there too, okay. The zombies are back, and this time they're more aggressive, okay. 
but we've got the secret, we've got the secret sauce for them. We're eating them back, okay? <laughs> that wasn't funny. Very sad. Yeah. If any of y'all eat any of my severed limbs, I'm haunting you, okay? So don't do it. You don't really look tasty, I can be honest with you, I'm just saying. Tastes like chocolate. Whatever, dude. Okay, <laughs> whatever. I'm not even going on, I'm not even going on the road, whatever. whatever. It tastes like chocolate. So, Shayla. I feel like human meat, I mean, never mind. No, 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 you feel like I mean, human meat, what? Never mind. You it probably wouldn't taste that bad, though. It might taste like chicken or something, but better. Pork. Let's make, let's you make. You think it tastes like pork? I think pork is pretty close to the human, apparently. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's, 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 do, let's do this aviation. Aviate. Okay. Aviation. For Bambi. Yeah. Oh, For aviation. Wait, I don't even know if I have all the ingredients for aviation. <laughs> Zach says you can eat me when I'm dead. I don't mind. Zach. I still, this is still a crime, even if you're okay, right? Even if you're okay? Yeah, I, I don't think, think so. it's legal to cannibalize. Aviation drink. Okay, guys. Okay, check this out. So, aviation drink. Is, has anybody ever played the Tony Hawk skater game? Why? Mm -hmm. You know there's a song on there that it's like, when I die, bury me, hang my whoop on the cherry tree. Mm -hmm. When it get ripe, then take a bite. And if it don't taste right, then don't blame me. <laughs> okay, so listen to what I need from you. We have gin, right? Yeah. Okay, downstairs is, okay guys, so we're making this aviation for Bambi. She's one of, one of our members, you know. Um, <laughs> I remember Bambi. Okay, Bambi. <laughs> so I need creme de violette from downstairs. It's a purple liquid. Okay, what where? Creme de violette. Okay, it's purple. It's okay. in a purple bottle. It's okay. gonna be in one of the first two shelves. Okay. okay, I need that. That's so I've never even heard of that. And then I need maraschino liqueur. Okay, it's down there. Yeah, okay, I'll find it. Why don't you take your phone and call me? I can find it. No, just call me. Maraschino liqueur? Yeah. Just, just, just call me from the computer. And what else? You got the, you got the, you got Can the you link, right? Can you text it to me? Huh? Can you text me the link? <laughs> okay. Okay, guys, hold on. So Sheila's going to get our, our ingredients right now. Somebody says we got to use the uh, aviation gin. Yeah. No, we don't have to use aviation gin. <laughs> you don't need to use aviation gin for this one. Okay, call and link. <laughs> one of forever says, that's why I don't insult people by saying, eat my ass, because they're going to go all zombie on me. <laughs> <laughs> Shayla, what you saying? Watch out for the cannibals. Okay, hold on. All right, now you can call in. Shayla's going to call in. Make sure some lights on down there so they can see the liquor, okay? C call in, Shalo. Can we hear her down there? Let's see. Okay, she's calling in now. And then put it on out to the left. Like just that, yeah. Okay, Shalo. Okay, Shalo. Pull back. Ba back away from the shelf, okay. All right, so walk forward. Walk forward, straight forward. Not in that one, the other one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that forward. Okay, in the back, you see way in the back to the left, that's maraschino liqueur. Way in the back to the left. Me? Yeah, that, pull that out. Lizardo. Yes. Yeah, okay. Okay. Now let me see what else on that shelf right there. Let me see the shelf below that. Okay, it's gonna be purple, all right? It's going to be creme de violette. Go up top. Go up top. Go to the top. Let's see. Let's see what's on the top shelf. Up, pull back, pull back, pull back. Okay, let's see the other side. Top shelf. Okay. Ah, there it is in the back. I think that's it in the back. Is it purple? This? No, that ain't it. It's called creme de violette. It's, it's, it's purple. Hey Bambi, that's the problem with that's the problem with like uh, drinks like aviation. It requires special liquor that you don't use for anything else. Screw, go down one more. Let me see what on the next level. It ain't gonna be on there. Let's go on the next level. Pan around. Go to the bottom. Go to the bottom on the other side. 
Down at the bottom. Okay, let me see. Move around, move around, go slow. Pan, pan, pan. Right there. Right there, right there, right there, right there. That, that bottle in the back. Be no, 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 no. Pan to, the, pan to the right a little bit. Right there, that's it, homeboy. What that, what that say? Oh, yes, yeah, it says Violet. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> okay, let's, let's, kill her, let's kill her feed now. Okay, thank you, guys. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Sorry about that, guys. All right? My little sis. This is the best selection of all those. <laughs> Thanks, Haminator. Thank you, man. Um, well, we, we're working on it. We're working on it. Okay? Dude, that's a grocery store. That's walking past. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hold on. Let me tell you about the aviation, okay? So the aviation is a classic drink. This goes back to... Thanks, Big Mix. This Appreciate probably goes it. back to the era of Prohibition. This goes way back, okay? So let me, let me just... Creme de la creme, that's what we are. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Let's grab lime juice as well. Let's put, get, get poor spouts. We, let's not even worry about poor spouts because we're going to we have to um, measure. measure it. We can measure this. We can use the gym. Okay. All right. All right. Thanks, Louis. Lemons. You need a squeezer? Yeah. Let's get a squeezer. Let's use this. Oh, we got a super chat. Okay, from who? What we got going on? Eccentric that? critic. Thank hey, you. thank you, thank you, eccentric critic. Appreciate that. Appreciate the love. Okay, let's get a bottle now. One of these. We need some ice. Oh shit! My ice down here melting away. Should have done my favor. Drop this in the fridge, please. All right. We have a question for you, Shayla. <laughs> Are you married? No. Are you looking? Yes. You good one, boy. She's looking. If I introduce you to a guy and I'd be like, Shayla, that's the perfect guy for you, what would you say? Would you be cool with that? Depends on the guy, I guess. The Aviation is a cocktail made with gin, maraschino liqueur, creme de violette, and lemon juice, okay? So, maraschino liqueur, creme de violette, lemon juice, and of course, gin, all right? Some recipes omit creme de violette because they're sometimes hard to find, but I had the bottle sitting there, so we're good to go. Um, history. The Aviation was created by Hugo Anislin, head bartender at the Hotel Wallach in New York, in the early 20th century. That means the early 1900s, for those of you curious. The first published recipe appeared in his recipe book back in 1916, okay? Um, yeah, all right. Anything else you all need to know about this drink? So we can go with, we can go with one of the traditional recipes, but this is, this, is, this is the Wikipedia. What is creme de villa? It's just, it says it was among the native wildflowers found in the Alps. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, so, is it just wildflower? I don't know what it's, I don't know. I don't know what that's like, made from. What is it? I never. What I never looked it, it up. And you don't want this. This doesn't give you a good measurements. This just got a Coca Cola. It has on lines top. on it. Huh? It has lines in it. Yeah, but you got to know what those lines are. Alrighty. Okay. Let's go with that one. So we want an ounce and a half of gin. Okay. So let's get, let's pour an ounce. Show them the gin. Show them. Show them the whole process. Okay, guys. So what we coming in? McQueen. This is our jiggle. So we're pouring an ounce and a half here. Pour that out. Get a nice bubble. Keep coming up, keep coming up, keep coming up, keep coming right there. Pour that in. Beautiful. Ounce and a half of that. Now we're coming behind that with a half ounce of each of those, okay? This is the cherry liqueur. Or maraschino liqueur. Half ounce of that. Godwin says they went to school with you, Shayla. Really? Who? Sweet. Thing. Beautiful. Half ounce of lemon juice now. I got this. What school did you go to? You know, do you half ounce of this? Yeah. No, but go lemon juice first. <clears throat> so she's coming in with her lemon squeezer now. And she's gonna squeeze nice, a nice half ounce. You got it? 
So go ahead, squeeze the other half. I'm surprised that wasn't a half ounce. Hi, Roberto. Thanks for tuning in. You got to be strong. Squeeze, squeeze, brother, squeeze. That's a half ounce. Okay. Go ahead, part of it. Small size high school. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean? I didn't go to Northside High School. I went to the middle school for a second. Okay. Okay. In seventh now, grade, I went to the middle school. Oh Hold on. So now we come behind. <laughs> That's just this, the middle school that I went to in rural, rural Alabama, Northport, Alabama. It's very small. Okay. Very this is southern. saying. Okay. Wikipedia is calling for one bar spoon of that, but hold on, let's do that. One bar spoon? That's a, that's a teaspoon. One bar spoon is a teaspoon. Thank you, Rashida. But let's look at some Godwins, what's your name? Maybe I remember you. Creme de Violette is made from violets. From violets, right? Mm -hmm. But like, what does it taste like? It's like wild, the native wildflowers found in the Alps are the Queen Charlotte March violets. It says that this captures their fragrance and colors. So guys, one bar spoon is equal to a teaspoon, okay? This is five milliliters, okay? It's, it's a teaspoon. So I can just put in a little bar spoon of this. Shelly, you want to get a better angle of that? You want to hold that up? Okay. Let them see the, let, let them see the container too, though, so we, they can see it dropping in. All right, that's gonna give us just a hint of purple. That's not enough to really turn that purple, but whatever. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is how we roll. Whatever, okay? That tipsy okay, you can put it down now. So that's it's not pretty. That's not gonna give us a super purple drink though. Where's, where's our, where's He says it tastes floral like, like lavender. lavender. Where's our mixing tin? Huh? Where's our mixing tin? Probably in here. Shake it and keep it sexy, homeboy. Hey, Carlos from California, sending a what's up right back to you. No, it wasn't. And this is an aviation? Aviation, homeboy, aviation. All right. Wow. It doesn't even look purple. And then you would come behind that and you would drop in a maraschino cherry. Not the, not the, not the red cherries that you see me have. There's a more expensive kind. The dark black the ones? The dark cherries, yeah. I am. Um, the dark purple ones? I had some of those. I don't know where they are because we haven't used them for so long. But now that we're making a lot of drinks live, I think I need to keep them in stock. You know, because they they for more mature drinks, which we typically don't make on. Are, are violets right. purple or blue? Purple, violet. Roses are red, violets are blue. They more like purple, but whatever. Go ahead. Okay. Violets are violet. <laughs> Interesting. Hello, Lord Tachanka. What do you think? I like it. You like it? It does taste floral. <laughs> Dude, I need a fish you should write poems for sure. <laughs> huh? The red, violets are purple. I hope Shane isn't gay. So I can slurp on the nerve. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I need to fish. <laughs> this is good though, it tastes very floral. Okay. Sorry, I'm a little kid. No, 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 no. So guys, <laughs> with a drink like this, you're not gonna go to your regular dive bar down the street and find this one, because they're not gonna I've... have this. Okay. I've never made an aviation in all of my bartending career. I've never been asked for an aviation in all of my bartending career. So that's, that goes to show that I'm age. just going to keep quiet and just allow all that to right? just percolate That's into this. Ask Janessa next time she's on the show. Uh -huh, uh -huh. She's ever made an aviation. Well, the, the, but you don't work at the kind of bars that people come in and order this kind of drink, okay? This, this would be mixology, and this is, this is a classic cocktail. I worked at a supper club for a hot minute. I mean, it's still, it's still hardcore mixology, though. Okay. So, I don't know. But my point being is, your regular dive bar is not going to have this. Yeah. And then they're probably not going to even have this, you know, like Luxardo. Like, they don't? 
You see some bars. I mean, that most dive bars don't have this. They, okay. they don't do the kind of drinks, you know? Yeah. That you can find that in. So. What is a Flaming Mo? Flaming Mo is from The Simpsons. That's a drink. That's a that's mm. a that's an episode of The Simpsons. And so we've made variations of that. Oh, somebody was asking for yeah. it. Yeah. Because it's like a cough syrup that he mixes together with some shit. Ew. Okay. But anyway, again, you're gonna find this at your It's pretty. Bar. So if you want to try this, you gotta buy the ingredients and make it yourself at home. Okay? So if I wanted to seem sophisticated and mature, I can go to somebody's like really nice fancy bar and order an aviation. Yeah. Okay. That's what you do. So when when you bought when you out with your boss, those of you at that level level who get to go to dinner with the boss or yeah. something like that. Okay, what you don't want to go, give me a Long Island, give me a beer, none of that shit, right? That's when you can go, okay, give me an old fashioned, give me a Negroni, give me a Boulevardier, give me an aviation. Like these are drinks that you can now pull from that classic cocktail list mm -hmm. to let my boy, okay, this motherfucker knows what time it is, you know what I mean? Nice. Yeah. Well, Shayla would be like, hey, give me a steak with some side of ketchup. You see, you can't do that. I don't do ketchup on my steak, silly yeah. goose. I do ketchup on my steak, but not while, not while the chef looking. I don't, <laughs> do, I don't even do A1 sauce. Well, I have some ketchup for my fries, please. <gasps> okay. Did okay. we see what the poll said? Oh, yeah. The Diddy poll. Damn. Did anybody vote against him doing it? 21% said so he didn't do it. Wow, 21% wow. of y'all? Damn. Wow. 21% of them say he did not do it. Free Diddy. 21% <laughs> of y'all are Delulu. Uh, Delulu what? Okay, watch it. Let me Delusional. See. Why are you eating on these dudes? Delusional. It's okay. May your Delulu come true true. We know I need a fish. We know. <laughs> hey, is, where's my next strainer? My strainer in there? I'm just kidding. Look in there. Look in the box behind me. See if a strainer The is tipsy bartender strainer? Yeah. <clears throat> Isn't it? Uh, okay, sweet. Let's put it in there. Hey, Zix. Thanks for tuning in. Thank you, Zix. All right, guys. I got to get my ice ready. It should be about ready now, right? Oh. Can you hear it? Can you hear it? Here it comes. Damn, that's a lot of uh, water. That's how this game is played. You waste a lot of water when you're doing this. Shelly, get, get the bag for me, please. The bag I had you put away. Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, fill, refill that. It's a nice house. Fill it with water, please. I gotta keep my eyes ready, guys. Pascal, you're sipping on a delirium. I love delirium. He what? Oh, He's wow. He's sipping on a delirium. Oh, nice. On a we, delirium tremor? We, yeah. we sell delirium at my bar that I work it's, at. They're really good, right? Yeah, we, well, we sell it in a bottle. I haven't tried it, actually. It's strong. Is that? Yeah. And it's, it's like sweet. Like 8% or something like that, 7%, somewhere around there. Yeah. Whenever I go to Wisconsin, I'm gonna bring back some of their like local beers that. Um, that they don't sell in other places. Oh yeah. For you guys to try. Yeah, that will be. That, yeah, that will be awesome. Actually. I'll do it. There's they a, have a there's lot of little breweries, huh? There's yeah. yeah. All right, guys. If you guys ever go visit Milwaukee, definitely make sure you go on a tour, a brewery tour. Stefan, slide that over again to, to where it was before. Oh, sorry. Right, I don't right, know right, what right, happened. Right. Okay, yeah. Okay. Okay, guys. Stefan, hit me with another one. What time this guy is right it? here says he has the fastest shotgun time on the planet. Hey, we're gonna see about that. What the fuck? What? That's them dudes with no gag reflex. Let's go, baby. Wow. What? How do you do that? Speed kills. Huh? No how gag reflex. How, how can you do this in such a wow? Play, play, play the play again with without the sound. I mean, it, it just that um, he could open his throat. <laughs> he could just open his throat. I've never been able to successfully do. You have a gag reflex. A, um, yeah, but I've never been able to su successfully do a, a shotgun. 
I've never done that. I never even tried. I never even tried. You've never tried a shotgun your whole life? We don't really do that in the Bahamas. So dudes don't But you've been in America for the past 50 years. But I still Bahamian. So some rules I don't break. Got you. <laughs> I'm both. This is so crooked. The point is, it works, on boy. Shit, imagine the police coming, right? Ice is illegal. We gotta get rid of this before they walk in. Here, Shiver, stash this. Go ahead. Not in the bag, homeboy. You gotta hide in your clothes. I'm not doing that. Okay. I'm just trying to prepare her for a raid. Okay. <laughs> Why would I need to be prepared for a raid? I'm not P. Diddy. <laughs> <laughs> You're the only one here who's been to this house before. So? Which one you been to? You been to the LA home? Yeah. Up in Humboldt Hills? Or wherever that is? Mm -hmm. How is it? Nice? Hmm? Is it nice? It's, it's nice. Like, I've only ever been in the studio in the house. I haven't seen the rest of the house. But I'm... No gag reflex. <laughs> Diddy, Diddy has, has that issue too. too. But I mean, so you can't, I mean, but it, I'm assuming it's a huge home. It's very big. Mm -hmm. Like, ridiculous. It's, yeah, it's really big. True. He has like two gates. <laughs> one for regular people, one for the servants. Mm -hmm. There must be a bunch of people working there as well, though. Yeah, probably. You met the sons? Mm hmm. How were they? Were they cool? Um, yeah, Christian's really nice. <laughs> And um, so is Justin. How old, how old are they now? Are they like in their 20s? Yeah, Christian's a little bit younger than me. I was just listening to like Christian's music. And how old is Justin? With Christian, so I feel really bad that he's in handcuffs right now. Justin's the oldest one, right? Justin's older. He's like, I think he's 30 or something. Shit. He's kind of short though. What, too short for you? Mm. But Christian was just playing me some of his music, teaching me how to do a little dance and everything. And I was like, what? last week or something so this is really interesting stuff okay you know it's really sad to see shale on the street so boy she know what time about that she know what's going on on there no nah, i don't know what's going on how would you rate that i'm just an innocent bystander folks. okay you can put the one away how would you rate that aviation can you up? um thank you I'll put that away for you. Thank you. Thank these you. are some impressive pieces of ice. We mean these are some impressive these pieces. These are of better ice. than the last ones you've been cutting. Huh? They're cuter, they're thicker. Yeah. She thick. They're, they're cuter, they're thicker. You know what I mean? Thick them. We got it figured out. Okay, Bambi. So, some people are asking if this is a bong. A bomb? A yeah, what? No, this is just like a drink. No, this is a drink. This this had a this had a whole one of these in it, but it's 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 done now, so you could just sip on it. <laughs> no bomb. I like the smell of that. It does smell really good. I'm just drying off the counter because that towel is soaking wet. I might as well leave this in here. Hey. Might as well so they know what's going on. Right. So you all know what time it is. The icy blue. Okay, Shayla, I got, I got a food recipe for you today. Icy blue fish bowl. Let's put those two back, please, okay? For the next time I need to open something. <laughs> <laughs> Couldn't even get your leg up. Dude, I could totally get my leg up. Cha, cha, cha. I'll just play around. Cha, cha, cha. Okay. All right, do me a favor. Let's yes. plug this in. Push those strings up. Plug this in somewhere. Good, you got it there? Sweet. How y'all doing? It's Monday. Meaning? Damn. It's Monday. Damn, it's Monday? <laughs> yeah. It's like, whoa, it's a Monday. Okay. I, he's the only person I've ever seen store bacon. Ooh, smashed tacos. What do you mean store bacon? In a glass container like that. Really? Yeah. But, okay, well, what do you mean? Like, it's weird to store it? 
I've just never seen anybody do it like store it like that. No, but I'm different because I mean, like we have to cook recipes all the time. So this bacon would be old. No, it's not, it was not to be old. I'd always have, you know, I'd always have to have bacon on hand. So it doesn't make sense throwing away a couple of strips or even freezing them when I have. I'm them just ready. saying, why didn't you just leave it in this pack? Why'd you throw it in there too? To keep it fresh. To keep it extra fresh. Yes. To keep it sealed from the environment, homeboy. For you. Exactly. So you have a delicious See a food. bitch ass, don't come complaining. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. All righty. I didn't know y'all was listening. You hungry, body. homeboy? I didn't know y'all was listening. I ate some ramen noodles, so I'm not that hungry, but I can always eat. <laughs> you love Mondays? You're the first person I've ever heard say that. <laughs> All right. Shayla, can you read my mind sometimes when I look at you? Nope. You want to try? Nope. What am I thinking right now? This is the most beautiful girl I've ever seen in my entire Not life. Not even fucking close. I don't even Not know even what close. to do with myself. Not even close. <laughs> <laughs> you set yourself up for that one. So guys. Can we make this hotter? No, that's good. We're good. We're good. We don't need to make it super hot. Okay? Why do you always like to cook it on such low heat? I'm not cooking it on low heat, Miss I Can Cook. Okay, while that's going on, we need to do something else, okay? And I need you to be open, motherfucking minded for this one, okay? Okay. I don't need no shit. Okay. okay? I'm just saying right now. Is it Tuesday morning already, Dave? If there's gonna be a problem, I need to know. Okay, what's All right, up? guys? It must be a buttload of cheese being involved. No, no, no. There's no cheese in this. What? I mean, sorry, there's cheese in this, but there's oh, no cheese wow. in this. Oh, wow. Okay, watch out. I don't want you to get burnt, okay? I'm not gonna get burnt. D Dave, where are you watching from? Australia? Tuesday morning here. Sunday morning, breakfast. Okay, guys, so check this out. We can we can slap these down. Breakfast shot with the bacon, somebody said. What are you doing? Hmm? What are you doing? I'm hoping. <laughs> Why are we throwing that on that one now? Huh? Wait, wait, wait. He said Australian. I, is he in Australia? Skies, so. skies are afraid to burn shit. Rather take forever to be safe. That's the thing. I only got one. I only have one set of stuff, right? Which is why you don't start off on a super high temperature. Okay. Don't worry. This is already washed. Okay. Is he putting raw meat on a tortilla? Yeah. Raw, unseasoned? Yeah. Raw, unseasoned meat on a tortilla. You Blue have... cheese. Ryan, are you trying to poke my buttons? Poke your buttons? Oh, wow. Okay. Look at that. <laughs> raw, unseasoned ball of delicious ground beef being slapped onto those. Okay, this one, this one, this one a little too big though. This, this piece here a little too big. Okay, that's better. Damn, that bacon sounds Wait, good. oh. What? Uh, I thought somebody said it was Saturday over there. I'm like, where in the world are you where it's anybody, Saturday? Anybody on Saturday. <laughs> There's no one on Saturday. <laughs> the most anyone's gonna be ahead is 24 hours. No, I would like, but what if, what if somebody's behind? Saturday, Sunday, Monday? No, no, no one's, no one's going to be that far okay. behind. 9.40 a.m.? Wow. We're towards the end anyway, you know? Because it's, it's California, then you get into Hawaii. Then after Hawaii, you got a couple other Pacific Islands, maybe, and then you go back to, you pass the, the you know, the, the, the date line. Hello, okay. Dave. Do you like okay. my Australian accent? So take a look at this guy. So what we're doing is we're flattening this out, right? <laughs> we're smashing this. Interesting. Burger patties? Yes. Would you just, this is like you acting like all intellectual. Interesting. It's interesting, Sky. What's interesting? Like you're making like burger tortillas? Yeah. Yeah. You see that? Burger patty? Smash tacos. Yeah. You see it? Are you going to season it? Yeah. Nice. You want to get some seasoning? Go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead, get some seasoning. Homeboy. Oh you got me doing all it like that. You got me doing all the hard work. You don't have a roller? Huh? Because no roller. You're, you're supposed to smash it like this. Okay, guys? You're supposed to smash it like this. Where do you want me to season it with, Sky? 
What do you mean what I want you to, the stuff that you like to season with? What do you mean? There's All no right. rules on this. MB says, Shayla, I'll poke your buttons, but Sky, that beef needs seasoning. <laughs> Dave, do you sound like this when you speak to people? Was that a great, was that a really good? English? No, that's supposed to be Australian. Oh my God. No? No, it's beautiful. Thank you. You're so talented. I've been working on my accents. Hey, yeah. mate. <laughs> You're like a young Susan <laughs> Sarandon. I've been working on my bloody accents. <laughs> I'm really terrible at accents. you like Halle Berry in a prime. Was Halle Berry <laughs> doing accents? No, I'm just fucking with you. You know Halle Berry in that movie where she had that blonde wig on? And it was like an updo? You know what I'm talking about? What was it called? Baps or something like that? Baps? Yeah, have you seen that movie? It's yeah. like a 90s. Season number two. Or is it? It's, I think this is the late 90s. It was super good, that movie. I really enjoyed it. And everybody's hairstyles were so good. You, really? Mm-hmm. You gotta watch it. Okay, okay, guys. You all saw that seasoning up, right? Flattening everything out. Getting it right. Watch it. Let me flip more. Let me... Ah. Watch it. Let me flip more. Flip more. See? Okay, you done? You done, homeboy? No, I'm not. I'm almost done. All we need is some salt now. Season salt. Oh, Jesus Christ. Hold on, just let it season this for one second, okay? Cut down this one a second. All I did was season it with smoked paprika, onion powder, season salt, okay. and pepper. All right. But it's nice and seasoned now for you folks. Should I do this last one? Consider we have. Eh. Unless Stefan wants one. If you have space, if not, it's all good. Yeah. Yeah. Five yeah, pieces of bacon. Yeah, Sheila, Sheila. Mash that Five meat. tortillas. Tortillas. <laughs> Mash that down, please. Quesadilla. Quesadilla. Yeah. Okay. Spread that out. April, wasn't the fashion in that movie so good? Which movie? Baps. It's called Baps? B-A-P-Z or something like that. Yeah. The fashion was so good in that movie, though. Like one, I want to dress up like that for Halloween. Grab the seasoning, let me grab the seasoning. Grab the seasoning. <laughs> Just so we save time, because you got to undress and all kinds of shit, like your ring all over the table. Undress. You know what I mean? Like she ain't, she ain't built for this old boy. All right. All wow. right. All right, Stefan, let me, let me see. Let me see. Hit it, 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 it one more. One more time. Hold on, so you went through all that just to get some liquor on the plane? I mean, you could do that, you know, because they don't really check your minis. So if you go in and you change all your little lotion bottle and shit like that to mm -hmm. liquor. That's I mean, what my friend does. Yeah, but why the fuck when you could buy alcohol in the airport, though? Because, I'll, I'll, but have you seen the prices? Yeah, but dude, that's a lot to go through to empty out all that shit. Mm -mm. You just buy the whole little case of the travel, the travel pack, the travel empty bottles. They sell them in packs at like Walgreens or wherever. Uh huh. And then you just pour the liquor in them. That's what my friend does. Yeah, but like you know, these airlines that don't allow you to. Yeah, like I know. Post. I know. Like that's. That's like wild though. Like you get a ticket and then you're not allowed to have your own booth on there. Like yeah. even if you buy it from uh, duty free. You, you're yeah, not you're, not, you're not supposed to open it on the plane. Yeah. Liquor? I mean, what are they gonna do? Kick don't they out? sell liquor on the plane though? Yeah, yeah they yeah, want you to buy theirs. They, they want, want you to fucking buy theirs, bring, bring your but own. But not bring your own, you know. Even if you buy the liquor at the airport? Yeah. Yeah. They don't want you drinking on the plane. Interesting. You know, they don't want you. They don't want These you. are not, this is not sizzling at all. I get that. I get that. I'm looking at it right now. Okay. I'm working on it. Okay. Okay, mama. I'm sorry, mama. Okay, Stefan, scroll that. Scroll that for me. I never meant to hurt you. But tonight, I'm cleaning up my closet. Okay. <laughs> All right. So Boeing is back in the news. Who? Boeing, the airline. The CEO has finally stepped down. Those of you who have followed to fly should know that they're. You, you've not, you familiar with this at all? Boeing? Uh-huh. Mm-mm. They've had a ton of fucking problems. Like, Which have began people died? A, oh yeah, they, this began a couple years Don't ago. Don't fly with, Boeing. With, with, with a crash, with two crashes, okay? 
with the plane boat. crash. Yeah, there was one. There, one how, was how one do you was, crash a plane? One was Egypt or Ethiopia? Which country was it? Because they, had, you remember, they had the, the Boeing. Yeah, one Indonesian one, right? Well, anyway, there was two crashes outside yeah. of the uh, outside. If of you're in a plane crash, isn't that like automatic death? No, much? not necessarily, but usually. Anyway, they had two plane crashes where everybody died. Okay, this is a few years ago. You have to look back. It's the Boeing Max 737 or whatever, whatever the Max version of the airlines is, right? And then recently, over the last few months, they had pieces dropping off. There was, there was just a flight the other day where the whole side panel came out because there were screws wasn't in it. And no one died because everyone, everyone was strapped in, in their seatbelt. But it was done. That happened at a height where, would have been, where you would have gotten sucked out, but everyone was wearing their seatbelt. Which is why when you just sitting down there not doing shit, keep your seatbelt on, all right? Because you never know. And so you had that happen. There's been tons, there's been tons of stuff recently with Boeing. And the thing about Boeing, the best, the best, the best thing I can tell you guys to look at is go watch John Oliver mm -hmm. on YouTube. Because um, last last week tonight is the name of the show. Go watch him on YouTube on the piece where he discusses Boeing because he goes, they go into in depth how this is, how this works, how the inspectors that inspect Boeing planes actually work for Boeing because it's kind of done done on a on a system so to speak. Got so you. Shayla basically okay. would be in, in, would be inspecting Shayla's plane, you know, and it's just a ton of little shit. And Bo Boeing at one point was synonymous with quality. Because I think the phrase was, if it ain't Boeing, I ain't going, right? What? And, no and way. then they partnered with MacArthur Douglas, I think, this, this arms manufacturer. And ever since then... It's been going downhill from oh, there. Oh, fuck yeah. Dude, shit's bad. That's... that's, that's so now, now you have like websites like Kayak that tell you what kind of plane it is you're flying on so you can make the decision based on that. Because there are tons of people who aren't flying Boeing. And a lot of Boeing employees do not fly Boeing Airlines. Wow, because they know it's sketchy. Yeah, so that's just something for you all to look at if you are flying someplace. You know, I've always kind of wanted to open up my own airline. Oh, fuck, really? Yeah, like, <laughs> but like, I want to open up an airline and like, I want it to be like luxurious for everybody, you know? And I want it to be like super spacious and for there to be like karaoke and stuff, like a fun time, you know, when you're flying. And I want my planes to be like bright colors, like, like purple, blue, pink, and this green, can be sold yellow. A, and you want this to be cheap. <laughs> I want it to be affordable, but nice, Luxur luxurious, affordable for people. You know? I think you got to pick. I can't pick luxury and affordable? No. <laughs> like, I want my like flight attendants to like host, you know? Mm -hmm. Like, play games and stuff with the passengers. You want them to like, be fine. Huh? Some fine chicks coming out the back. Hey, guys, who? In their cute little outfit. Oh, we will be twerking <laughs> at 25,000 feet. <laughs> okay. There's Shayla. <laughs> soul Plane. Yeah, kind of like a take on Soul Plane. I'm looking, I'm looking forward to that, Shayla. I'm down. I think that'd be fun. I think it would be fun, too. Yeah. Okay. I'm Put down. my face on the side of every plane. like. Yeah, I'm down. I'm just kidding. I wouldn't do that, but. Yeah, guys, you should all fly with the European Airlines. <laughs> <laughs> I get a discount if you would get a ticket. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm just, I'm just saying. So they, they finally, so the CEO finally resigned, and maybe, Bo but it's gonna take Boeing a while because they have, they have infinite damage that's been done to that brand. They need to basically start all over. Like I say, go and watch John Oliver last week tonight. That's the name of the show, talking about Boeing, because he goes into more depth. So are they going to shut down? No, they're not going to shut down. They keep going. I mean, it's only, it's too big. But who's going to want to fly with them with all this controversy? I mean. Because that's like gambling. That's taking a gamble all your life. Yeah, but then I mean, like, come on now. <laughs> that's like, like buying. That's like purposely. People, that, no, that's like purposely hey Dave, buying a car that you in. know has recalled, mm -hmm. but it's like, well, it's. You know, it's super popular, so I'm going to get this call. Okay, this I'll tell you this right now. The one, one of the goals that these airlines want is they want to get rid of pilots and have it more as a drone, right? Okay, you're looking at me like that now, but here's how you fucking get to do that. Because you're saying you'd never do that, right? You'd want a pilot, They would right? still have to have a pilot there, though, just in case anything, hap anything I mean, happens. It ain't like the pilot could help with much shit now anyway, because these two plane crashes that I talk about with Boeing, the pilots couldn't, couldn't rectify what was wrong. They didn't know. They were completely fucking unaware. But anyway, here's the thing. The goal is to have these planes fly themselves using drones, because that way you don't have to deal with the pilots it. union and all this sort of shit and this dude retiring and all that. They won't get rid of that. 
And a lot of you going, well, this guy, there's no way I'm doing that. Here's, yeah, that's here's why you're going to do that. That's sketchy, though. It's because they can suck you in with a ticket price out of this world. You know what I mean? Round trip from here to New York for like $50, but it's a drone. Would you go? You could do the same thing. No, would you go, though? No, you could do the same thing with Spirit Airlines. I'd rather fly Spirit. At least I have a pilot. I'm telling you, a lot of people can take that deal. And then over time, as more people sign on and they realize it's safe, then the price increases. So they don't care that you don't, that you can say People that. say this like machines have never malfunctioned before. They always malfunctioning. So then what the hell am I going to trust a machine but with my life? You but I mean like it's, it's the military is killing people all over the world. It's so like it's so precise. With, with, with drones. With the drones. Yeah. It's, it's super precise. It's super like, precise. I don't know why we still have pilots. But yeah. what if like what if there's somebody's flight gets delayed and now they you know like what if there's somebody's landing at the same time? Everything is exactly the same. You're just not in the cockpit. And if you have the whole system automated, it probably works better because now yeah. you know where everything is. Wait, now you know where all yeah. the other It's when you have are. humans in the mix. That's where shit gets wild. Did you ever see Breaking Bad? <laughs> yeah. I'll take the drone over spirit. I'm with you, Dave. I'm oh, with well. you, Dave. Did, you, did you see Breaking Bad when that dude had them planes crash into each other? You know what I'm talking about? Um, His daughter died. And so he had them two planes crash into each other. On Breaking Bad? It's like season three or something. I don't even season remember two. that episode. I don't remember that. Man. But I did watch Y'all know it. what I'm talking about, right? I did watch Breaking Bad. You don't remember that part? How are you going to forget? I don't know. I forget a lot of shit. This is the... This is... It, are you going to cook it for longer? Yeah. Why? I've just never seen bacon take so long to Well, like, this hasn't been at a very, very high temp, okay? Okay. Got you. Besides, I, I can put this back... I can put this in the... Grab me, grab me that, grab me that. Yeah, thing. so someone says driverless cars and driverless trains in Asia. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And like at a lot of airports, we already have driverless uh, trains. Right? Have, haven't we run into issues with those driverless cars though? With the cars out here, yeah, because. I mean, but you know, when Elon tell you your Tesla full self-driving, that's not entirely true. <laughs> that shit ain't full, full, fucking full self-driving. Are you going to get the Tesla truck? No. Why not? Why would I want that ugly ass shit? It's pretty cool. <laughs> pretty cool looking. You think that you think the truck look good? I think it looks ugly and big, but it's also pretty cool at the same time. I, think. I don't know how it feels. Okay, but that is what she just said. She thinks it looks ugly and big. But, but it's also pretty, pretty cool at the same what, time. What do you mean that someone has one? Just the uh, just the concept of the damn thing. It's nah. like a big old It looks like a tank. Dude, if like you have a military if tank. If you have money, do something else with your money. Instead okay. of getting a Tesla truck? Yeah. Guys, check this out, okay? Now we coming in with our burger party patties. Sheila, hold that for me. Hold that for me. Okay. Why are you slapping on here like that? Because you got to slap down, homeboy. Tacos. I put my bacon on. I put my bacon back in for just a little bit, you know. Yeah, crisp it on up. What? Where do you go? Yeah, yeah. But, it, but anyway, as Arkansas as said yes. But driving a car, you can fall thousands of feet to your death. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like a a plane, a car crash is an automatic death, but a plane crash is probably nine times out of ten automatic death yeah but planes are gonna be drones pretty fucking soon you gotta understand like firstly with the pilot thing they don't want paid on but is that a liability though what to have all these human lives at stake there's like some flights are like a hundred people so i don't know y'all because if you have a self-driving car it's like i'm choosing myself in this car it's no just but your, me. your car could still kill people yeah, you, that's true. Because I've seen videos yeah. of Teslas just take off. At least so people claim they've just taken off. Really? Yeah. So it really depends on how you look at that. Don't get a Tesla if you're ever against the government, right? Because <laughs> I imagine they can probably just like... But any, any electric, all electric cars are able to be controlled from outside the car. Yeah. And that's the thing. And like with yeah. Tesla, there's a camera inside the car. Yeah. Connected to head off. Don't be on the run with a Tesla. So, so you out there doing some freaky shit in your car. Elon Musk sitting right there eating a bag of popcorn watching you. You know what I mean? Which is why, like, if I got a beef with Elon, like, like AOC, for instance, Like, you mean, right? like, car sex and stuff? 
Yeah, like whatever they can look in. They have been looking in. They've gotten trouble for looking in. It's a reason why in China they don't not allow their execs, the members of the political parties, the big political party, the to CCP, drive to drive Teslas, because they don't want a fucking outsider in your car. You see? Wow. I did not know that though. I knew there was cameras all on the outside of the car. Yeah, but in, there's one inside, and that's that's why when you drive in, sometimes if you're looking at your phone and the thing in autopilot. You get beeps because they can tell where your eyes are. You see? Creepy. No, but all all modern tech like that it mo it monitors you. You know what I mean? So, so I guess it is creepy, but it is the way it is. It, that, that's not gonna change. That's the that's the way things are going. You know? All of you conspiracists out there, just <laughs> go rent a, a log in a cabin in the woods or something to have your meeting. <laughs> to have your top secret government meetings. Go rent a cabin in the woods. Go rent a cabin in the woods. Or no, better yet, build yourself a cabin in the woods so you know there's nothing. Okay, Sheila. Oh, wow. It's getting interesting, folks. So should we turn one of those over now? Let's see. It's getting interesting. Let me see. Slide over. A little bit more. A little bit more. Okay, Stephanie, let's do another one. What they play? Spike your drink. Is it that easy? Didn't we? Didn't we? We skip some. It's that easy, huh? Did we skip song? some? Huh? Did what, we skip what some? What song is this? I don't, I don't know. I saw the wine. And I, I love this girl. I love her. I could have picked chocolate. Then I would have stopped it. But I drank the wine. It was Jesus' favorite drink. So I think I'm fine. The Catholic guilt <laughs> will drag me down to the depths of hell where I belong. I just hope they have a bong. Right out. <laughs> <laughs> she is so funny. So you've seen her singing before? I've seen her before, yeah. That could have been you, man. That's supposed to be I you. know, right? She made a post about how like, she was in her head um, when it comes to social media and the internet a lot mm -hmm. until she stopped caring. And now, ever since, like, her life has been great. Grab, 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 the, grab the camera. Interesting, folks. This is some interesting stuff, y'all. Free Ranger, are you at Guy Fieri's restaurant in Vegas? Like, I think he's asking us what he should order. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> like, really? Like, what are you thinking about? That is not what you think about. <laughs> he's a Guy Fieri's restaurant <laughs> in Vegas. We can definitely help you order some shit. <laughs> Dude, where are my letters? Oh, the letters right here. Why are you screaming? Hmm? The pickles. Are you going to chop up them pickles? I love pickles. You love pickles? Mm -hmm. Wait, Dave says Australia has mobile detection cameras for phone use in cars. So like specifically, they, they're there for the phone use or what? That's crazy. That's kind of cool. Okay, hold it up, Sheila. Hold up. Wow, y'all. It it's getting real interesting. Can you do one without or no? Yeah, you want me to do one without? Yes, please. What are we making? These are... Smash tacos? Yeah, smash tacos. Smash tacos, homeboy. Okay. Smash tacos. Now let me come over here with my little knife. <coughs> and I want to get... I want to get some tomato on top here. Let me get rid of this piece here. That kind of old, so let's come up here. So Shelly, you could sing songs like that, right? What? Wow. You love this knife. Me? Mm-hmm. Me and my friends were talking about this knife. Really? <laughs> what did they say? Jade? Remember when Jade was watching? Oh, she's supposed she's supposed 
the, the friend who flaked on you that day, or you flaked on her? Huh? You mean the friend you flaked on? I don't know what you're talking about. She remember mm. she came in and she watched the um, stream? Yes, but you flaked on her. She was supposed to meet you at the pig or something, and you didn't show up. Oh, yeah, 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 sure. You flaked. Um, who flaked? I don't know. Who flaked? Well, I know it's you, but I'm just trying to be nice. I don't nice. know who flaked. Did you not tell her to meet you at the pig? No, nobody's, nope. Boy. I said I was going to go to the <laughs> I said I was going to go to the pig and I ended up not going, but I didn't flake on anybody. It was just plans changed. Okay, grab the camera up front there. Wow. Smooth. Okay. Holy crap. Oh my God, it's so hot. I can do it. Are, you, are your fingers too sensitive? Huh? <laughs> what? Are your fingers too sensitive, Sky? <laughs> I can do it. Your fingers too sensitive. Are you a little bitch? <laughs> <laughs> Your fingers too sensitive, Sky. <laughs> I'm actually meant that. Yeah. I wasn't trying to be an asshole. I know. I know. Welcome to the show, Lavish Volcano. Thanks for tuning in. Okay. All right. y'all okay so homeboy okay now you come in with a little bit of tomato tomato okay i might need to fix the camera a little bit but we good that's good okay okay come Thanks. in with a little tomato okay come somebody in. said those look good come in with a little bit of lettuce a little bit of lettuce i think they look good too Okay. Are you going to put pickles on it or something? Yeah. Wow. You high maintenance chick. I love pickles. What else do you love? Mm, I don't know. <laughs> Adrian says those are some peculiar looking tacos. <laughs> <laughs> you should just slice it into one long slice and lay it across the top. Turn the camera a little bit. Uh, I mean. All right. And now, homeboy, now we come behind all that. Okay, all tight. Somebody said American cheese on a taco is a no-no. Clearly these are taco burgers. Taco burger tacos. Burgers, right? And now we come in with some of our burger sauce. It's also called American cheese product. Okay, not too much, please. Will you do mine like that? Well, I didn't put one here for you, considering that you didn't want the cheese. Okay. The cheese one, the che okay. one without the cheese is right here. You're right. No, 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 we could do it. You're right. Yeah, dress it up. Customizable. <clears throat> Cheeseburger tacos, yes, Mads. Welcome to the stream, thanks for being back. You want any of that, you want any of that seasoning? I mean, you want to eat it? Somebody says you should call it the Taco Bell burger taco. <laughs> but aren't you putting cheese on it anyway? But I don't like American cheese. Okay, fine. This is Mexican cheese. She's so high maintenance. Perfect. This chick's so high maintenance, homeboy. Okay, you all back here? We could drop on some American, I mean, some Mexican cheese. Nice. You could go close there. Oh, me. yeah. Oh, yeah. Drop some Mexican cheese on top. These look like the bomb.com. Mm -hmm. These look good. And it's that from the Okay, 90, ready? 95. Probably. You ready? Okay, here goes. Oh. 
It's good. What do you think? <laughs> hmm? It's good. You have the Shayla seal of approval, ladies and mm. gentlemen. Wait, was there also some bacon? Oh yeah, there was bacon too, shit. Oh, schnauzer. <laughs> Thanks, Melissa. Video. Thank you, Melissa. I appreciate it. I totally. Yes, you're right about the bacon. That bacon looks good too. Yeah, you want one? I got a bacon for you. <laughs> we got a super chat from Money Man. He says he wouldn't put vegetables on mine. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's fair. How about the pickle? You consider you consider the pickle a vegetable? I mean, it's a cucumber. Yeah. Yummy, yummy. Mm -hmm. chunk of you too. Really? Can you have me a little plate? Thank you. Okay, this one's the truth. It's good. I don't need one of these though. It's good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it was easy. Bernard mm -hmm. also thinks it looks good. Thank you, sir. Pretty easy. <laughs> yeah, that one was damn good, homeboy. This is like a 3 a.m. I guess mm -hmm. if you have it, that energy in you. Scroll down for me, Stefan, please. 3 a.m. snack. Okay. So. <laughs> Laza Pippin is back in the news, those of you who are curious. You know, okay, so that's Laza Pippin. It's Marcus Jordan. Laza is Scotty Pippin's ex-wife, the famous basketball player. This is the ex-wife. Isn't she dating that and child? And this is Marcus Jordan. This is Michael Jordan's son. So those of you who are doing the math right now realize, wait a minute. His, <laughs> she, used to, she used to play with this dude when he was a kid, right? You want any models? No. Nope. She used to play with this dude when, when he was a kid. Anyway, so they're finally broken up for good. Oh. She claims that she wanted someone who had more ambition than he does. Okay. So she broke up with him. I don't know who broke up with whom. Okay. Well, but it sounds like that if she's claiming. I don't know, but she's just saying he don't have enough ambition. He's Michael Jordan's son. Like, how much fucking ambition you want him to have? You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> like you know, we ambitious because we hungry. You know, we are there trying to make money. They already got it. Like, I mean, I you mean know? that's true. Yeah. Like, how, how fucking more ambitious you want him? <laughs> Is that him? Mm -hmm. He looks her age. Hmm? He looks her age. She's Hi, 40. Eddie. Thanks for tuning in. She's 49. She's 49? She's 49, she I think. Good. And he's 33. I mean, okay. Yeah. I mean, that's quite an age difference, but. Hmm? It's an age difference, but it's not, it's not as crazy as I thought it was. Like, if he was in his 20s, then that'd be. Yeah, but the problem is. His dad used to play basketball with her husband. Like, you know, the, with her ex-husband. Yeah, well. Uh-oh. Oh. Are they really, really done, though? <laughs> Probably not. 49. Michael probably told them, don't bring her around the house, though. Michael probably told him, don't bring her around the house? Yeah. Because, 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 does he still live with his dad or something? No, I'm just saying. Just in general? Do you think why? Because it, it'll piss off Scotty? Dude, Scotty and Mike, without Scotty Pepper and Michael Jordan doesn't get those championships. I mean, some people in here might have, some people would see that differently. Scotty Pepper is one of the greatest ball players of all time. He's top 50 all time. I know Jordan is king, but still, he couldn't do this without Scotty, dude. So they, you know? So they're tight. <laughs> so it's just real awkward Thanksgiving. <laughs> no, it's not that they're tight, because they fell out. But the problem is, you have that history. Scotty and Jordan? Yeah. Well. No, but that don't give your son the right to go bang, to, to snuff me go It ain't gotten done, nothing to do with him, though. Yeah, my point is, leave that shit alone. There's some people you can't date, you know what I mean? Why? Because like, you just can't. Like, okay, how the fuck I can date you? Work together. Just be happy, y'all. Just be happy. Imagine me dating you. You. Don't ooh me. You wish, motherfucker. You wish. Okay? You wish. Okay? But think of how bad that would be for the show. Where are you going, homeboy? Could you I come dropped back some stuff. I, I dropped some stuff story? on the floor. Could you come back as I tell this story, okay? Look at this, okay? I know y'all going, Scotty. Do you want to be my mentor? No. What the fuck I would mentor you about? Everything, so I can figure out how okay. to get a nice house okay. like this? Firstly, you never listen. Uh, no, okay. <laughs> you don't listen to shit <laughs> no, I say. Okay, but I'm saying, 
I'm going to start listening. Re now you can start listening. Mm -hmm. Now, how many years I told you what to do on TikTok? I said, Shayla, do X, Y, Z. Let's go back. How many years? I don't know, Sky. Like, if you had to ballpark I know, it. but can you be my mentor now? I wasn't ready back then. Oh, you're fucking ready now. Mm -hmm. Okay, but the point is the internet probably done with us now at this particular point with all this AI shit out there. And now you come, now you come to me like, hey. Please? Sure, you feel to ask me questions, but like to be like a mentor, mentor. Why don't you? But every person who's ever been rich has always had a mentor. So if I want to be rich, I need a mentor. Yeah, but I'm. I don't consider myself rich. I know you probably think I am, but I'm not. Yeah, but you're way better off than I am. I know. But so mentor me. Okay. Help me. Help your girl sure, out. Sure, just ask me some shit, okay? Do it on camera though. You know, like how people go out. Hey, me. I mean, me and my mentor are going to no, we fuck, no, we're not. Unless you buying, you buying me dinner. Hmm? Yeah, we could we could talk over dinner. You paid? Mm-mm. Okay. I don't gotta like that. Okay, we're we'll just checking. Yeah. Is I agree. You can't date your best friend's ex. Is that there's a, a few people that you can't? Someone asking you that is that a turn off? Is what is a what is, is what a turn off? Shelly, come back. Shelly, come back. <laughs> She'll have you here, man. <laughs> call me daddy. <laughs> 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 Tachanka. Okay, hold on. Okay, homeboy, drink time. Okay, you all call out another one. Call out another one. So, Bamboo, we did your, <laughs> we did your um, aviation. Stephen, did you want one of these? Yeah. Or you I, I'll get one later. I, I don't want to eat it on the laptop right now. Okay. It's, Thank you. Don. It's real juicy. Yeah, that's. <laughs> I saw it. Looks. It, it smells amazing. It's I'm good. Gonna definitely eat one later. It's good. Should I eat another one? I mean, go for it, you know fat what? ass. No. <laughs> Hold on, excuse me. <laughs> I think I may have misunderstood what she just said. Did this girl just call me fat ass? Did I she? don't know, did I? I'm sorry. We You're the one who can't even bend your knees. I can bend my knees. Bend them. Why don't you take this fucking jacket off and let them be the judge, homeboy? Or who is fat? I'm cute. I'm not fat. They didn't see my arms that they looked before. Your little saggy arms. Okay, 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 okay. What? Can we do a shot, a layered shot or something, or a fun shot? Okay, step one, Shayla. Watch a tipsy boy. <laughs> okay, Jason, you're not. Jason, I'm not talking about that sorry. kind of mentorship. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry. You're not talking that. about sorry. bartending over here. We're talking about life. Way to go, Jason. We're talking about real life shit. <laughs> okay. Matt said, don't insult your mentor. Matt, okay, you're right, you're right. Matt, she don't listen to Jack Shadow. Look, you're not a fat ass. I'm sorry. No, no, I'm, I'm just saying. <laughs> If I like Shayla, look both ways before I cross the street. No! No! No, I'm not looking! Boom! Get hit by a fucking truck. Shayla, you just got hit by a truck. Yeah, but I wanted to get hit I'm by the truck. I'm telling you, Sky. I wanted to get hit. I was young and naive four years ago, and maybe even this last was, year. Was, no. And I'm a changed woman. I'm ready to grow up now. Okay. People change every day. For Let the me matter. tell you the most common question you get as an influencer, right? Especially like if you got a little bit, like tipsy bartender of history. So you all know it comes and it goes. Sometimes it's hot, sometimes it's not. But you all have seen, you all, most of you all have followed me, right? The number one thing to do is come to you and be like, okay, how did you do it, right? And then you tell them. And then immediately they start going, oh boy, I don't know about that part. But like, well, like, maybe if I do this, like, oh, I can't do that. Oh, okay. oh, I can't do this part. Oh, I can't, you know what I mean? Like, the, the main thing is, the main thing is, time and you got to be unrelenting in your pursuit of fucking this like there's no downtime like even if i'm not here no like off you, days no because you the internet's always on so you still got it ain't like on a tv show like if you look at like friends not that i'm comparing myself to friends but if you think of a tv show like friends right they have a season they have some episodes and then they shut down and then they come back the next year okay and people are excited yeah so. but with the internet there is no shut fucking down you know what I mean? Like, we don't get to take days off. You have to keep going, you know? And that's the hardest part, because it's freaking grueling, especially when you only pick it up one subscriber every blue moon, and you figure, why the hell am I doing this? That's the time when you need to go even harder. Dang. You know? So you gotta, you just gotta, you just gotta be serious. Like, you cannot fuck around. You yeah. gotta give it your all. But what about this TikTok thing, though? Should I still post on TikTok before yeah, you shut it down? Yeah, you should still post on TikTok because you don't know. Make, make some sky ju- Oh! Oh, Mirage! Your boy, guess what? Why are you what? screaming? I got- Hey, hey, hey. This between me and him, okay? <laughs> and I wish you'd say, why are you screaming when you start fucking laughing? Okay? Because that'd be an appropriate time to go, Shayla's laugh. <laughs> 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 okay, when she's doing I thought she'd pretend. I was like, 
I was waiting on the hidden cameras to come out and be like, Sky, you've been pranked, but it was real. Okay, okay. Tavio on Heard, twerking Puerto Rican. Half, twerking Puerto Rican. Okay, one third Red Bull, half scotch, half whiskey. Dude, scotch is a whiskey, just for the record. Splash of 151, <laughs> okay? Scotch is a whiskey, okay? A bourbon is a whiskey, a rye is a whiskey. So it's scotch basically a whiskey. a whiskey Red Bull? I don't know. I don't know what he's talking about there. That's literally a whiskey Red Bull. Anyway, guys, the main thing is... <laughs> With rum at the top. With the the rum main rum. thing is, if you can do the internet thing, you just got to go hard. But before you do that, this whole AI thing, changing the game. So before you invest your life, yeah, I don't know what the fuck. Before you quit your day job. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. Don't quit your day job. Yeah. Fuck, if you even have a day job, be very thankful because yeah. most of us can be jobless soon. Yeah. Okay, Sheila. What was, what was that? Hello, Henry. Right Thanks for tuning in. Oh, shot. Oh, not the tweak in Puerto Rican, because that's a no, glorified... No, 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 that's not going to work. Oh, my boy just told me about Sky Juice. Oh, Sky okay. Juice. Hey, guess what, guess what? I got, I, got, I got coconuts right here. Grab me one of them coconut on the fridge, please. What is a Sky Juice? Sky Juice? Mirage! Yeah. Throw it. Damn, you see, he's just throwing a coconut at me. Did y'all see that shit? Okay. <laughs> he said throw it. Whenever the police start asking, well, who is the violent one on the show? Make sure, y'all make sure point to Shayla. All I have to do is get out that huge Chinese knife and be like, this is, this is the evidence. <laughs> what is a ditty shot? <laughs> <laughs> Does it require Skittles? <laughs> <laughs> Tasting the rainbow? Dude, oh my God. I can tell you all right now, I still wouldn't play with that dude if I was some of you all. Because that dude ain't no joke. Remember, to rise to the top in rap, you're dealing with some gangster motherfuckers underneath you. Which means I feel like you he done to, killed a few people. You have to be bad than them to get up top. So don't think that, don't, don't listen to all these diddy this and don't diddy that. Killed. And think that this dude's soft. He's not. Okay? He's had a few people killed, I think. I mean, I think to get to that level, to be to be that ex kind of executive did, in this did, game, you but, probably but have to... But come on, Drake is right up there too, huh? Yeah, but Drake, Drake, Drake's different. Cause I don't think Drake's Canadian self oh. killed anybody. Canadians okay. are really nice, and they say oh all the time. Sheila, this has condensed milk in it. I don't hear shit. Okay. Okay, hold on, I mean it like that. I want to hear some shit from you, okay? Hey, 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 who's a pretty girl? Who's a pretty girl? Who's a pretty... Guys, y'all see how motivated us? Y'all see how condescending that is? What? Who's a pretty Talking girl? to me like I'm a pet? Like, a, like I'm a goldfish? Or a child? Because I said who's a pretty like girl? Like a three-year-old? Okay, sorry. You're very pretty. Thank you. Y'all, I am not wearing a bathing suit. I'm never going to wear this top. That is a bathing suit, homeboy. Okay. It's not. It's not water resistant. It is a bathing suit. <laughs> it's not water resistant. That's a good one. Drake had his homeboy killed. Who? Who? Who had his homeboy killed? I mean, who's up there with Drake? Y'all think Kendrick then did something weird? Y'all Kendrick's right up there too. Or the top three or whatever. Did y'all see Kendrick's new verse? He came for J. Cole and what? Drake. Why is he going to J. Cole and Drake? Kendrick? Yeah, what'd they say about him? He came out for blood. But what? What? I, I mean, don't know. They said that he was Drake slept with Diddy. How do you know, Big Mix? Were you there? Were you there watching Big Mix? Um. Apparently, they're saying that the top three is like Kendrick, J Cole, and Drake, like the top three rappers. And Kendrick okay. was like, "Fuck that! I'm not nobody's top three. I'm, it's just me." Or something okay. Like so I need the thing to open this. A knife? A no, bread knife? No. There's there's a. It's a tool. I know exactly what you mean. No, 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 it ain't in there. It's not, not in there, not in there, not in there. <laughs> All right, good try. It's to open an egg. Okay, not a fucking coconut. <laughs> All right. Why don't we, we ever use it to open eggs? Hold on, let me, let me, let me, let me see. Who did he have killed, y'all? Who had his homeboy killed? Who? Who is Drake's homeboy? Hey, Red, where's the, where's, the, where's the coconut opener thing? Coco Jack. You want to grab that for me, please? Because I'm exactly sure, so it's going to take me too much time to look for it. In the corner where? Lord Tachanka, you did not just say 6 9 is 
better than Kendrick Lamar. Yeah, but I mean, like, <laughs> um, you don't think you could actually Lord do Tachanka, that. I've never judged you for anything until right now. I just put her on the stands and then she right like, oh, now. Wow. Right now. Right now. I'm judging. Huh? Ice JJ okay. Fish, y'all okay. are hilarious. Okay, right. Okay, what y'all saying now? His name was Anthony Soares. I'm going to look up with Anthony Soares and see what this is all about. Okay, so hold on. Why did he have to kill Anthony? What did Anthony do? So Sheila, I need, I need some ice. Let's grab some ice. Okay. Let's grab some ice. <laughs> Arkansas. <laughs> Look in the drawer. I don't know you. <laughs> <laughs> Arkansas. Smart ass. Only one piece? <laughs> Only one piece of ice? Yeah, hold on. Leave the there for right now, though. Let me, let me out. Thank you, Henry. Okay. So let's get our mixing tin together. And let's... The mixing tin's right there. Let's come behind... I'm oh, sorry. I'm mi um, mixing glass together. We can drop some ice cubes in here. Guys, look at look look at the look at the shine on this ice though. Look at the shine on this ice, okay? It's pretty. Y'all can't tell me that shit ain't pretty. Y'all can't tell me it's not. Thank you. Thank you, Red. Here you go. Okay. Where are you going? I'm putting the ice away. Oh boy, let's go, let's go. Okay, okay? I'm we got the to ice move. Away. I'm putting we got away. to move. These people are thirsty, okay? <laughs> Don't be hitting my hand like that, oh boy, okay? Don't you ever. That's how we talk to each other when the camera's not rolling. Don't do your face like that, okay? You're scaring the kids. <laughs> <laughs> You're scaring the fucking kids. Don't okay, do that. Sorry. God damn. <laughs> okay? Now, if I just tune into this channel, I'm unsubscribing. What okay, kids? Okay, you know what the hell I was. What kids? <laughs> All right. <laughs> So let, give me two ounces of, give me two ounces of. of and that. we're using gin. Gin, okay. Two ounces of gin, homeboy, okay. So one that's one ounce. One ounce. All right. Pew. Give me one more. Two ounce. Okay. Pew. All right, now homeboy. Stephanie also made clear eyes for her party. You didn't that's, see that? that's, that's what I'm talking about, nice. Stephanie. Uh. Okay. That's nice. what I'm talking about. If you bring these out at your party, your guests will be like mind blown. So y'all keep these in your back that's pocket. That's sweet and sour. When y'all need to impress, okay? Only when you need to impress, that's when you go out like this. Okay, now next up, we come in behind this with some condensed milk, okay? I know a certain person here doesn't like condensed milk, but that's okay. This one's the truth. Okay? She's looking at this girl. Ew! Don't lie, that's what you're thinking, right? Pew, pew. Pew, pew. Think of those days. Mm -mm. No. Look at this. No. Look at this, homeboy. I don't want it. Mm hmm. <laughs> that's the taste right there, homeboy. That's the taste right Angel there. Angel Dixon, I love you. Okay? I love you. Why is it like that? Hmm? Well, she says, she says, I love you. She's talking to me. I know, but I, I want her to know that I love her. Don't worry about Sheila. Angel, I feel you. <laughs> I know what you're feeling right now, okay? I love me too sometimes. He's such I'm a hater. I look in the mirror at night and I go, wow, that's gorgeous, okay? Except for this little grown. There's a small chance she could have been talking about me. No, they're not talking about you. Okay. We just have to approach reality. You have to be realistic, man. If you can do a show like this, you got to be, you know, grounded in reality, okay? How many people look at you and go, I love you? You ever had a dude say that? Um, yeah. How long did that relationship last? Mm, about a year and a half. Fifteen minutes. About a year and a half. Guys, I got my little coconut opener-like thing here. You all see this? Okay. What is this? Okay. 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 All right. Like all right. that? Okay. Hold, 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 hold the camera up. Hold that camera up. Can I do it? Can I smash it? No, you it? cannot. No, you can't. I want to smash it. Because it'd have to be smashed properly. What do you mean? All I you gotta do is put it right here and I then smash it. No, you don't. I can show you later, okay? <sighs> he never lets me smash. Oh, no. <laughs> that sounded very wrong. That sounded very, very yeah, wrong. We're not smashing. There's no smashing going on here, okay? She wishes she could smash this shit, okay? I would smash this too. You know what I mean? Look at that, homeboy. Look at that. Huh? Look at them short shorts. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, back here. <laughs> Disturbing. Disturbing. All right, 
so guys, I hit in the front, right? That's why I didn't want her to do it. Why? Because I couldn't have done, you don't think I could have did that? Could that you could have done this? No. You, you don't think I could have did that? That you could have done this? <laughs> you don't think I could have done that? <laughs> okay. Guys, so check this out. We come right here. You can lower it a little bit, okay? And I come in there. It's purple. I mean, that's, 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 the, that's the color of this particular coconut water. It isn't purple. It's mm -hmm. a very thin skin, so you've seen the brown behind it. Oh, okay. Is it good? You've seen the best taste in water. Pineapple? Hold on, let me, let's, let's get... Let's Is it get, old? Give me the next, give me the next one. No, it ain't that it's old. It's like that, sometimes. It looks like it sounds like somebody's dog is dying. Throw that. I only got two, so if this one's if this one's all purple too, then we screwed. If it's purple, it's screwed too. No, no, no. I mean, like, Can I, I, let me do it. Let me do it. Fuck. <laughs> 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 no, you hit in the front. I need that piece to go in. Like that? Yeah. <laughs> oh, fuck. I still don't have He's going to blame uh, Of course I can blame me. me. <laughs> 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 the juice just squirted <laughs> on me. Oh. Okay, you know what? That's probably my fault, honestly. <laughs> I, know. <laughs> I know it's your fault, which is why I didn't want you to, which is why I didn't want you to do it. <laughs> I feel like I always prove Sky right, and it breaks my heart. <laughs> okay, let's look at the color of this one. This one is not purple. That one is not purple. Yeah. Okay, that's a better color. Oh, that's wow. That's much better. That's crazy how different that is. Yeah. Huh? <coughs> mm -hmm. Okay, let's start again. Let's grab this. Give me. Okay. Right, so we're coming back here. So give me two ounces of gin. Good. <coughs> yes, ma'am. All right, y'all. <laughs> Me to fish says so I wants to avoid blaming Shayla the <laughs> <insist>. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, so what are we doing again? Two ounces two, two, of gin. Two ounces of gin. We're starting to mix over, guys, because we have better coconut water right now. So how do you know that a coconut's gonna you, be you bad? You don't know. You, you don't know until you open it. That's fucked up. I'll get my refund. You don't know until you open it. You got two ounces of gin in there? Two ounces of gin. Okay. My friend might like this drink. She loves gin. Now we come back, back behind that. Now again with our sweetened condensed milk. Okay, this is squeeze pack, and I'm glad we saved this for moments like this, you know? How do you know how much to put? Is it just eyeballing it? Eyeballing it. I mean, it tastes good anyway, to me at least. Okay. Be careful. How you know? That's how, a piece of coconut. How much? How how you know how much to pour in there? It's just eyeballing again. That's coconut. That piece right there. Okay. Now let's shake it up. Alrighty. Can you hand me this mixing tin? Mm-hmm. Shake it and keep it sexy, homeboy. Ooh. Lord Sachanka, are you an island boy? Would you say coconut water is good for hangovers? Uh, I've never heard that before. Somebody was asking. It could be, but I've never heard it. All right, y'all. I think we're good. Is it? I saw that. Let's see. What are you, what are you doing now? That was my, I just shook it and keep it sexy dance. I just shook it and kept it sexy. Wait, are we using a strainer? Are we what? Am I straining this? 
Watch it, I got this. All right, guys. Lock you. What is this called? Sky juice? Mm -hmm. It's called sky juice? Mm -hmm. Hey, Mirage, check this out. I can hit this with a little cinnamon stick. Cute. I don't see you all do that in the Bahamas, but. Wow. I knew it was going to be too much coconut water in that glass. Why? 630 says Caribbean represent. <laughs> yes, sir. Okay. Hold on. Let me, let me hit that with a little. What would be better, Sheila? Cinnamon or nutmeg? Nutmeg. You think nutmeg? Yes, sir. Why you say that? Because you already use cinnamon. Little nutmeg. Okay. Oh, that's the right smell too. Go ahead. Grab a straw. A straw? Mm-hmm. So guys, that's it. Come in close, Stefan. So this is it, you know? Which one? Anyone. I should have started my own paper straw company once we started going paper. <laughs> Probably be a millionaire by now. Alrighty. Do you know? Don't tell anybody, but it's Do you know? Do you like it? Yeah. I don't feel like it's one you would like because of the freaking because of the uh, condensed milk. It's really delicious, actually. So this, that's, that's a Bahamian tropical drink. Wow, it's so good. Hey, Mirage, you all notice I hit this with a cinnamon stick and some nutmeg? Homeboy, yeah. I see that in the Bahamas, okay? I'm suing. Don't steal my ideas. <laughs> <laughs> this is good. <laughs> <laughs> Can't even really taste the gin. No, but the gin, the gin, the gin's in there, you know. Yeah. Arkansas, why would you never drink this? It's actually really, really good. Huh? How come what? Arkansas says she'll never drink this. She she uptight like you. That's why you all get along so well. <laughs> <laughs> you hear him? Two haters. <laughs> Two haters. I ain't gonna hate on Arkansas though. She's nice. She's nice, much nicer than Sheba. Why? Because I didn't get you a candle? Huh? Because I didn't get you a candle? Yeah, because you always come in looking for shit. Arkansas sends shit, okay? Uh, I'm burning a candle right now. Touche, touche. You don't like coconut? What? I don't think she likes coconut. Oh, she does? Oh, you don't like coconut? Oh, okay. What are you going to do with these? You got to get the coconut meat out of there and eat it. Yeah, I know, I know. Thank you, Beautiful. Captain. Captain fucking obvious. So violent. It's a thing, man. Good food calls for violence. <laughs> oh, yeah. Wow. Good food calls. Good food calls for violence. I mean, that's, that's not you mean what? totally you mean, untrue, you right? You mean what? It's not totally untrue. Dave says that's a Bahama Mama. No, it's not. <laughs> Bahama Mama? It's literally called Sky Juice, not it's after me. It's called Sky Juice because it looks like... Sky with one Y. Right? Because mm -hmm. it looks like something. Yes, the real actual sky. It, it, are you going to put a piece of coconut meat in here? Hmm? You could garnish it with like a little piece of coconut meat too. Th that wouldn't be cute though. Okay. Thank you, Arkansas. Okay. Welcome, Josh X. Okay. Hi, Arkansas. Hi, Josh. You want to taste the meat, Shayla? Hmm? You want to taste the meat? Mm -mm, good. I know what coconut meat tastes like. Really? Why you say that? What is this? What is this tool? Why you say mm -mm, Can I I'm see? Gonna, huh? This tool? What the fuck you think? He I'm has so many tools here. Okay, cool. Thank you. Like, what does this do? Uh, it's. You literally just saw him do it. <laughs> <laughs> I was doing it. Is it you, for the coconut? What the fuck you just see me doing? You blind? <laughs> <laughs> what do you want? Crack? Yeah. You should go, garnish it. No, you wouldn't garnish with this. It's a big piece of fucking hideous looking meat. What are you gonna do? Put this on this like as a fucking bouquet? Like what are we gonna do? Huh? <laughs> no. You can like stick it, cut it into a little triangle and then stick it on the side and have it floating on the side. Or I could stick it in my gullet. Okay, you could do that as well. I'm gonna go potty. Oh god. Yeah? Matt says it would look pretty with a tiny bit of blue curacao. Eh, it probably
probably would, huh? <laughs> what? I was just thinking about it. It's going to turn it like white blue. Not so much that it changes I'll only drop the flavor. A bit. I'll only drop a little bit. Yeah, but on the bottom. Uh, Should I stir it? No, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Try it, try it, try it. It's not really that blue. It's going to be more green than anything, I guess. Yeah. See if you do uh, the I didn't really do any do. Taste it. I didn't really do much. Taste it now. It is kind of green, huh? Taste it now. Tastes the same. Yeah. Not too shabby. Okay, I'm going to run to the bathroom. Okay, wash your hands, okay? All righty. Shayla. <laughs> Shayla's very regular. At 4.40 every day, she has to take a dump. <laughs> Two dumps. Okay. Hit me one more, Stefan. Where were we? This one. What was the smuggling one? And what was shot? Okay, go to shotgun first. No, that shotgun one. we already watched, remember? Shotgunning the beer and like the Oh, yeah, okay. And then smuggling Smug we watched too, I think. Oh, that one, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, go okay. In Ireland, when you get a pie to Guinness, they have a tradition called splitting the G, which means the line, the white, the divider between the white and the black. Uh, should fall where the, the black is below the G and the white is above the G. Uh, so you want to take a pretty big gulp. And I tried it yesterday. I took one big gulp and that wasn't enough. So uh, today I'm going to go for two or three gulps, uh, big gulps, and see how that works out. Yeah, I've heard about splitting the G. Yeah. And as you can see, the black line is below the G, and the white line is above the G right here. So I call that a success. <laughs> they do have something called splitting the G, okay? It's just not drinking the whole thing. You got to get it to stop right below the G, okay? Get the foam to stop right below the G, and they call it splitting the G. I guess if you drink enough Guinness, then you know, you know? <laughs> I'm drinking a bottle of... Oh, nice, nice, old boy. Try to split the G. See what happens. <laughs> Give me one more, give me one more. <laughs> 20 years from now, she can be asked to explain this video. Okay. <laughs> one more, one more, one more, one more. <laughs> Wasn't looking for love tonight. <laughs> <laughs> That's a heart attack, old boy. Not the Ciroc. Okay, scroll that, scroll that, scroll that. Yeah, because that could be too strong, man. That is that is freaking nuts. Okay. All right. So, Rebel Wilson is back in the news now. So, Rebel Wilson is putting out a memoir. You know what Rebel Wilson is, right? Pull up, pull, up the, pull up the image. Okay. Okay. Rebel Wilson's doing a memoir. She lost weight now. You okay. shouldn't say this, but I, I so used to being like the bigger girl that it's so weird now trying to, you know, but hey, what I'm she happy for like No, she lost, she lost a lot of weight. She isn't, she isn't like that size anymore. Okay. Anyway, apparently there's someone that she's worked with who was who was a real asshole to her, right? Really mean and stuff. Mm -hmm. And she donates. She she dedicates. Sorry, this is me donates. Dedicates a, a lot of pages in her memoir to this fucking dude. This dude. Right, and not everyone is saying the dude in question is Sasha Baron Cohen. Okay, we don't know that it's him, but they believe that it's him that she's talking about. Like he did some fucked up shit to. Her. Oh really? Maybe not. Maybe not like in a sexual way, but maybe it was just very mean or rude or condescending or some shit. Mm -hmm. and that that's uh, that's about to come out. So his people are denying that it's him. Mm -hmm. He's very upset. Expect some lawsuits to fly. Okay. They dated? No, not not dating. I mean, just his wife was on this fucking movie. Oh okay. Um, it's just like you know. She has, she has some complaints. We don't know that it's him, but they believe it might be him. You know? Mm -hmm. what is it? Oh I think God. she's really funny, though. I like her. I her like her, too. I like her, too. I like her, too. Mm -hmm. I like her, too. She's, she's cool, too. Mm -hmm. you, know? you met her? No, 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 no. I mean, I'm just saying she's cool, like, in all the interviews I've done. That's not a good... That's, 
that dude, that's not a good idea because the nicest dudes you see, like you think could be nice, they some real assholes. Uh, yeah. And the real assholes are the nice ones. I heard, I heard that about Zoe Deschanel, which is super sad because. That she's an asshole. Yeah, New Girl's like my favorite show ever, and I was like, I met Lamorne, the guy who plays Winston, mm -hmm. and he's cool. He's cool. Yeah. But apparently, he told his friend that like, man, Zoe was a bitch on set. Like she refused to talk to any of them when they weren't <laughs> rolling. <laughs> Which is crazy, because it's like, Zoe, you know? I mean, maybe. Yeah. I don't know. He's doing well now, though, because I see him everywhere. On the BMOs? Yeah, I, I, see, I, see him, yeah I see him doing tons of stuff. Scroll down for me, Stefan, one more time. Okay, guys, so let's talk, about, let's talk about my boy, Mr. DeSantis, now. He has just signed a bill banning social media for all kids under 14 oh. in the state of Florida. Okay. Okay, but you can't say, oh, that ain't that simple. Okay? <laughs> I'm not going to do that. That's going to be some fucking losses. Y'all should have seen Stefan's face just now. <laughs> yeah, because he's thinking the same thing. I'm thinking, like, dude, there's no way. Like, everyone. I think it's smart. All these kids are going to be okay. Yeah, but then, see, the way social media is built right now, sometimes They're just going to be lying. When, you're, when you signed up for MySpace, you have to be 15, right? Mm -hmm. I totally signed up for MySpace when I was 13 and lied about being 15. Yeah, you can have some of that. But the, the problem is... The companies would be sued for each, be sued like ten thousand dollars for each instance of of a, of a minor being on there, right? Someone under fourteen. That's that's his bill. But see, the problem is, a lot of people use social media to log into all kinds of stuff. You know, like sometimes you sign up with your Facebook or you sign up with your YouTube or you sign up with your TikTok or some shit like that, right? Mm -hmm. And it could be sites that have safety implications, or you know what I mean. You get what I'm saying, like. Social media is vast. So yeah, to so say that said, it'll be hard to ban you. Right. So to say that these kids under this particular age can do, that's a huge lawsuit. So it's not going to be successful. Because I think about YouTube and like how many children videos are on YouTube for kids. You know, mm -hmm. like, like. But the parents would turn that on for them. Exactly. So you could use it, but I think you need to have your parents' permission or something. Gotcha. Basically, it's it is impossible to enforce. It's really hard to regulate. Yeah. Yeah. So this this one's not one that's likely to work out. You know, so if you're in Florida, you should probably get on the computer right now, get your last couple of uses in, okay? Actually, we don't have anyone under 14 in here. What do you think the average age is in here? Uh, in what, California? In this chat. Oh, that's a good question. I would say in 20, 20 to 35. Okay. 20, 25 to 35 is in, in Probably that? somewhere in there, somewhere in there, somewhere in that there. Andrew, somewhere in there. Okay, scroll down for me one more time. One more time. Thanks, Henry. Guys, did y'all see what Russia did to those terrorists who got caught? <laughs> Uh-oh. Okay. Dude, they beat the living daylights out of these. They wasn't even hiding the torture. They were doing this in the light of day. If you're planning a terrorist attack on Russia, you better make sure you fucking die in that attack, okay? Because if you're still around when the attack is done and you get captured, homeboy... They will make you pay. The pay that these dudes been through, incredible. Okay? They really beat these dudes up. Damn. Yeah, they... Are they going to kill them? Um, eventually, probably. But my problem is, trust me, they will die. They'll die, they die in captivity. Okay, but the thing is, um, again, Russia is still saying that Ukraine had something to do with this. This was not a Ukrainian attack. Remember, I told you all this on Friday. They're still saying that Ukraine... Ukraine. I mean, Putin's saying that, I mean, but the whole so world... He has an, so he has an excuse? No, yeah, but the whole world at this point knows that this is straight up an ISIS attack, okay? And a lot of people forget that Russia is all across Africa right now beating people up, okay? And parts of the Middle East working people over, okay? When I say people up, I meant like Muslims, okay? So... That, ain't, that shit's not going to go fucking unanswered. So, you know. And now, ISIS threatening to, to attack them again for beating these dudes up. <laughs> okay, Russia against America. Who's going to win? How you, when you say who's going to win, what do you mean? The Russian army against the American army. We both have nuclear weapons. No one wins. No one wins? No, because they launched a bomb. Okay, if, if, okay, we, if, if we weren't allowed to use nuclear weapons. Then we'd win. You think so? Hands down. Them Russians be big, though. Them Russians be fighting Dude. in some crazy ass ways. Have you seen their fighting technique? Okay. Russians are scary. They are scary because they back <laughs> shit crazy. I've never <laughs> seen dudes fight like this. Because if you, if you want to, you could go on there and you could see footage from Ukraine, right? Because trust me, there's nothing America liked more than watching Russia fight and looking at their techniques and how they do stuff, right? Here's how they fucking do stuff. So, 
We have a superior position over there, unless there's 20 of us, mm -hmm. okay? Over here, there's 200 Russians, right? They would have, in, they'd put them in like, let's say, groups of 10, and have them fucking charge the position. You understand that? And just let, just sacrifice. Yeah, yeah. So you have stacks of bodies, but eventually you run out of arms. You can't hold it because eventually you can get overrun. But in order, but for those twenty guys to get overrun, one hundred and eighty of these fucking dudes can die, and that's the kind of trade-off they make. He does not care. He's have these dudes storming positions like with one gun, ten dudes, like crazy shit. I'm like, what? What are you doing? Like, no American general could sacrifice American lives. The way they did, the way they, the way the Russians fight. That is the craziest. Yeah, shit you know I've Russia. Seen. Russia scare me. Yeah. Remember my neighbors that I was complaining about? Yeah, they that, that be stumping and stuff. They're Russian. Hell yeah! You think I'm gonna go up there and complain again? <laughs> Hell no! <laughs> <laughs> Choose your battles wisely, people. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What, what, what is this? That's that's cheap. Oh. <laughs> Hold on, because oh, we can hear that, right? Okay, Why does on. it sound like the wind is blowing? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What what drink should we do next, y'all? Okay, guys. So give far, us we made drink. an aviation, What's which your favorite? is my favorite. This your one. Favorite? Did have, you want to try this one? Yeah, sure. It's good. It's really good. Thank you. We have sky juice, which looks like similar to. Bodily fluids, I suppose, so that's why he sky calls juice. it sky juice. <laughs> <laughs> we made good. this Ella. fish bowl. Ella. Just go upstairs, Sky, or call her. And we made burger tacos, so. What should we make next? Yeah, what drink you guys want to see? A boiler maker. I what mean, is a boiler maker, do you know? A shot and a beer. I want to do a shot, you guys. What are some fun shots that we can do? Like, <laughs> is that Putin sending a drone to Tipsy Bartender? I, I want to, so. I, I feel like. Um, Dark and stormy. The Dark and Stormy is good. I mean, I'm not a, fa a fan of Myers. Are there any other dark realms beside Myers? Any other what? Dark realms beside Myers. What kind of question that is? I'm asking, Sky. Yeah, there's dark realms other than Myers. Do you have any down there besides Sailor Jerry? I don't know. It's just, it's somebody like, said uh, Burger, or somebody said Dark and Stormy. Is Sailor Jerry a dark realm? Sailor Jerry, it's a spiced realm. Okay. Um, Okay, hold on, hold on. What's the drink? Let's Somebody said it. Boilermaker. Boilermaker's a shot in a beer. Let's do a shot. Twisted tea a fuzzy raspberry navel. flavor. What is twisted a tea? Twisted tea raspberry flavor. That's, it's that's already, a, that's already a drink. drink. <laughs> you don't have to cuss him out, okay? Sorry. No, I didn't cuss him out. A fuzzy navel. What is a fuzzy navel? A, a, you never do a fuzzy navel? What is a Russian bomb drink? A fuzzy navel is... is Vodka, peach, snaps, and orange juice, I think. It's the first half of a sex on the beach. Uh-oh. Me. Yeah. Diddy done did it. <laughs> Someone said Diddy done did it. We did a Manhattan before. Okay, guys, come on Russian now. Bomb. Come on now. Is Russian bomb a drink? N no, not to my knowledge. How do you know? What I'm about to Google it. A Russian bomb? Is yeah. it a drink? I'm sure there's someone who called it a drink a Russian bomb, but that don't make it a real drink. Russian bomb cocktail. Russian. And besides, that still don't mean we're going to make it. Guys, what do you all want to see? Aperol and High Life? <laughs> coconut cream pie shot, since you have coconut out. Okay, hold on, let's try. Molotov cocktail? A Molotov? A Molotov cocktail? Alabama yeah. Slammer. A Molotov cocktail in a cocktail. A Molotov cocktail is a actual bomb. <laughs> 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 That's the thing that you, when you, when you <laughs> get a bottle and stick it into liquor and then you light it oh, and Oh, shit. Alien brain hemorrhage. You want a brain hemorrhage? Oh, you Maybe. want an alien brain hemorrhage? The, you, have you, you? The brain hemorrhage is the one that looked weird, right? Or is that the jellyfish one? I mean, it's Superman shot. You can handle a brain hemorrhage. You want to try an alien brain hemorrhage, Shayla? I don't, guess. Don't, Let's do it. Don't Let's do it. me, boy. Is it going to look weird? Probably. Pascal, what the hell is a Cinderella? Cinderella? Blue and pink. Hey, slide them over. What is a Cinderella? <laughs> Straight Jägermeister, please. <laughs> Who likes Jaeger? Stop. Whoever likes Jaeger, you need to stop liking Jaeger. Actually, I'm going to stop judging you for liking Jaeger. Huh? Man, Jaeger was decent for like 
maybe five minutes of my life. <laughs> and then after that, I was like, what the fuck is going on? Hey, when a, when a grenadine that was, oh, fuck. Oh, yeah, alien brain hemorrhage. Yeah, everybody loves that. What is a mind eraser? Sky? Huh? What's a mind eraser? Um, that's uh, Kahlua and soda water and vodka. Kahlua? Kahlua and soda water? Yeah. That Kahlua. sounds good. Can we do that one too? Why, does, why would that sound good? It does sound good. I, I really like Kahlua. Huh? I like Kahlua. Okay, hold on. Let me find, let me find the grenadine. There's grenadine downstairs. Grab the grenadine for me then. <laughs> Sky stressed. No, because it's supposed to be up here. It was, it was I'll here. I'll grab it. It's fine. Hey, you took the grenadine downstairs? Okay, okay. Shell, I think grenadine might be the, up here. Is it up here? Yeah, okay, thank you. Okay, bye. Yeah, I got it. All right, guys, I got it, okay? We're, we're good. We're good. We're, someone said, didn't we make a cosmopolitan the other day? Yeah. We made a, we made a, we made a cosmo the proper way. So when y'all give me drinks, I try to Google it so I can get the exact recipe for y'all, okay? Do the Dr. Pimple Popper shot. Oh, that one's wild. <laughs> I forgot Shirley, should we check on this tomorrow? Because this can take a while to go in. Yeah. But let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's we, check on it tomorrow. We could, we could try it today. I don't think it's going to be ready, Scott. It's not going to be a full infusion. Let's but do we'll it tomorrow, see. then. We'll see. No, because the people here today. They're here. Y'all gonna be spots, here. Pause spots. Y'all gonna be here tomorrow too. Pause spots, please. Aren't you? You got the pause spots for me? I'm grabbing the pause spots right now, Sky, as we speak. Everybody, what was your last purchase on Amazon? <laughs> I'm curious. <laughs> Stop it, because I ask great questions, okay? Do y'all think I ask good questions? I feel like I'd be asking. Hey guys, so what was your last purchase on Amazon? Oh my god, batteries! Double A! <laughs> All right. Um, there might be some interesting comments on here. That's cool. Like what? Some dude bought a dildo? Like that's the best you can fucking get. Like what, no. what's, no, what's, what's interesting? Amazon has all types of amazing utensils. Like for example, this thing, right? <laughs> hey Twitch, welcome Twitch. You don't even know what the fuck that is. Or, okay. or the tool that you use to scoop. Let's, let's, go, let's go with this right now. How about you that? Know? Yeah, these, I can learn yes. about some new shit. Yeah. Pause box. <laughs> he wants Arkansas me to talk to y'all. <laughs> he wants me to talk to y'all. Uh, not on this one. This one, this one I always use. I keep the cover on, okay? But I want, right, beautiful. Stephanie bought a karaoke machine. Stephanie bought a karaoke machine. Way to go, That's Steph. That's really fun. Breast actually. milk comes. That's a good one. <laughs> Somebody let's, go, said, let's go, let's go, let's go. Somebody said OnlyFans. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, grab me a bowl that I can rest this on, remember? Like when you're doing a shot. A bowl? Yeah, a small bowl. No, down low, down low. Yeah, that. One of those bowls over there in the corner. No, yeah, yeah, right, right, right there, in front of your hand. No. Damn, Zag, you're living the, the bigger life. ones. Nope. To the left. All the way to the left. Grab the beer, yeah, grab the <laughs> Thank you. To the left, to Watch the out. left. Okay, guys. Can we see this now? Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay. So, guys, this is the brain hammer. So, Sheila, mm -hmm. we can start off with a little bit of this. Okay, guys? Peach schnapps. Hey, Aaron is Fan. Like Thanks for tuning in. Equal parts. John, what did you need them gloves for? Hmm? Okay. <laughs> Now let's grab, let's grab a, a, a spoon. A spoon. Not that kind of spoon. A bar <laughs> spoon. <laughs> Michael is asking, what would you call Jägermeister and Sambuca mix? A German-Italian. They probably have a name. Arkansas has got a body bag. For whose body, Arkansas? Okay, check this out, check this out, check this out, check this out. Nice, stop right there, right? Bang. Okay. Now, where's the cover for this one? Hmm? Where's the cover for that? For what? For this. 
put a put a out. I want Over I want here. the I, I want the I want it, but I want the cover it came with too. So guys, I just put some grenadine in here. Okay. So now let's see. Pour some, pour some blue crusoe in, in, in that cover. It's like a lion. Is it still moving around? Yeah, kind of. It's disgusting. What's disgusting? Huh? I didn't say that. Didn't you just say it's disgusting? Mm hmm. A little hater. Okay, blue crusoe, guys. How's that look, Shayla? Look at him. That looks amazing. <laughs> Why are you lying? Ah! Little back. Little right more. there. Thanks. Check it out, guys. Check it out. It's so delicious. What do you think it tastes like, Shayla? It's not going to taste bad. I can Sweet. I can tell you why. Why do you think this would taste bad? I think it's going to taste very sweet because of all the peach schnapps. It, it is a sweeter shot. It's not a bad tasting shot. It's not a, it's not going to chunk up. It's not going to, it's not going to curdle or anything like that. I wish they could see it from over here. So it's in it, it's in its final oh form right now. Wait, I want to show them. Oh my gosh. Oh. I'm sorry, the look is really throwing me yeah. off. <laughs> you think that look weird? You don't think it looks weird? Mm -mm. No, 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 not at all. Can I show, can, is there a way that I can show them? What do you mean you can fucking show them? There's it's the, a better, there's, there's like, a, a better right view? No, it's not a better view. The camera's right there. They can see that. Watch out, you put the, you If put it's the, better behind uh, white, if, if we put something white behind it, it's best. Okay, cool. Y'all see? Yum, yum. Ooh. Mm-hmm. That looks like a clogged artery. You think so? Mm-hmm. You ready to try this one? Are you down to try this? I'm down. I'm down to clown. Looks like poo at the top. I agree. All right, ready? Mm-hmm. And there you have it! The alien brain hemorrhage, homeboy, okay? Alien brain hemorrhage. Take a look at that, okay? That is the shot. The party shot. All right, go the ahead. The party shot. You think that's disgusting, don't you? <laughs> Just look at that sky. Have it's, a good night, Dorothy. It's not See you tomorrow, okay. hopefully. You got to go in one swoop, though, and do not spit that on my screen. Don't even come with that. Don't even come with that. No, I'm just really big on textures. Uh-huh. And you think the texture on that was somehow off? Yes. What did it taste like? Because I felt the, the chunks a little bit. <laughs> Go down. <laughs> <sighs> right? <laughs> she felt the chunks go down, homeboy. She felt the chunks go down. What did you think of the aviation? Huh? Maybe this is really good, actually. Somebody said nice, snotty texture, exactly. It's not a snotty texture. Okay. It just looks like it, though. You're just a hater. <laughs> mm -hmm. Let's check my level really quickly. Yeah, I got two. Thank you. Seven, hit me, hit, hit me another one. Uh, this one or this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Up there somewhere. Where was it? Wasn't looking for oh, no, that one. Send her on, boys. Send her on. Send her on, Send her on. Send her on. Send her on. <laughs> <laughs> Tomato sauce. That <laughs> he didn't even know. <laughs> Watch it again. Watch it again. Send her on, boys. Send her on. Send her on, Send her on. Does he not realize? Wow. He did not. He did not taste it? Yuck. Holy crap. Go on, one more, one more, one more. A vida é muito mais divertida com os amigos. Eu quero, eu quero. Ai. Nossa, com o Moran fica muito bom.
Parou aqui por acaso, hein? Me ajuda aí, Dan. That is a strong umbrella. It ain't gonna be strong long if I can break so. Right. <laughs> what is that tequila? I don't know what the hell that is. They sound like they speak in Portuguese. They don't sound like Brazil. Who knows? Cheers, old boy. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Well done. Well done, okay? Mmm. What? Look, ketchup and mustard on the tacos. You think? Mm -hmm. You put whatever you want on it. Okay, scroll down for me. So also in the news today, we have President Trump in the news. What okay. did he do? Well, he got his, his bond was re reduced from 454 million to 175. His so, bond? So he doesn't have to come up with half a billion dollars. <laughs> he just has to come up with uh, almost a quarter of a billion now. Okay. Or a fifth of a billion. He can afford that though. Um, right. Who knows? Who knows? We'll see. Um, but he has 10 days to raise this money, so, so so far so good for him, I guess. He has how long? 10 days. You think he's going to pull it off? Well, he can pull off the half a million and he had a couple, he had a little while. I don't know. I mean, that's a small amount. Maybe he could make and, more. And, and it's a civil fraud case? Yeah. Well, what, he, did he didn't pay his taxes or something? You have no clue what's going on in the world. Civil fraud? Yeah, this is, this is, this is the, this is the case where his companies were, <coughs> Make reporting the wrong building amounts for his properties, saying stuff, overvaluing his properties when he was going when he was um, going for loans, and undervaluing them when he had to pay taxes. <coughs> you okay. know, them rich folks, they really all they know how to. Yeah, hit me one more step and one more from up top there. Figure it out. <laughs> That's me. <laughs> I'm her and she is me. We are two peas in a pod. <laughs> Aww. Scroll out again for it. Scroll out again for it. <laughs> who else? Who else we got? Oh, dude, Titanic. Where are my Where are my Titanic fans? So you know the door, the door frame that Rose and Jack were on. The door. Oh, at the end of right. When, when Jack drowned, mm -hmm. yeah. so that was just auctioned for seven hundred and eighteen thousand dollars. Someone purchased that particular door. What they gonna do with it? Put it in their house? No, I mean, what do you mean? That's a collector's item. I guess it's fun because then whenever you have guests over, you can be like, "This was the actual <laughs> door." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I mean, like the person, <laughs> the person who has that is already probably super fucking rich. Yeah, I mean, you know what I mean. Unless you like, just be buying hopefully. dumb hopefully. shit for yeah, sport, yeah. Man. Unless you're like a real idiot, but you would then take that and then you take that one and then you fucking put it in your house and. But you can enjoy. obviously keep it for a very, very long time, and then once it becomes vintage or whatever, you can like that'll be worth some money, right? Yeah, I mean... It's kind of an investment, right? It's already worth some money. It's an investment for the guy who bought it, right? Because... Yeah, in time, in, in time, family, in time, the, 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 the value will go up, yes. I was talking to my friend the other day, and he has, like, a lot of designer bags, right? And he was saying that he doesn't want... Because he's never home. He's traveling all the time, and his friends are like, just do an Airbnb. And he was like, no, I, ha I need somewhere to put my stuff because those bags... They're valuable. Like when they become vintage, I'm gonna make a lot of money off of those bags. And I never thought about de like designer stuff as an investment like that, you know. But I think that's really cool to think about certain things that way, like having certain paintings in your house. Um, like Jay Z talked about how he had a painting that was like a million dollars, and now it's worth like ten million or something like that. Mm -hmm. Thing is, when you're listening to Jay Z talk about the painting that he bought for a million dollars, I mean. It's like Eddie Murphy was talking about this painting he bought for 50 grand, right? That's now worth millions of dollars because it's an original, right? Right. And, uh, but if okay. you're rich, you might as well invest in those kind of ways, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. But they're already rich. I mean, you, you, there's no comparison of that for like someone who's poor. Because you can't take 50 fucking grand if you're struggling and go out and buy a fucking painting. Yeah. And then sit on that painting for 20... How, I don't even know how, years, how Eddie Murphy had this painting for about a good 30, 40 years. He bought this, he actually he bought it when he was a teenager, like some of his Ooh. early money. Okay, wow. Or like early 20s. Yeah. And this dude like 60 now. So imagine how long he had that. So you can't sit on that like that. So there's, there's, no, there's no real comparison. They were saying that he bought, he bought the door so he could prove that Jack would, <laughs> would have fit on the door. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, because that, that part of the movie pissed me off, too. Uh, yeah, that was, that was, uh, but he had to die, because that's, that's the story. Whatever. He had to die, you know? He could have lived, and it still would have been just as good of a no, story. No, I don't think so. I but think it would have been. The story was good because the old lady died, right? And then Jack died. What? What old lady? The fucking old lady with the with the chain. She didn't die in the fucking movie. Yeah, she did. No, she didn't. Didn't she die at the end? No, she did not. You sure she didn't die? I thought she did went to bed. And she di- didn't she die in her sleep? I don't think she died in her I think sleep. She died. She yeah. died in the sleep. Hold on, guys. Those okay, you, after she threw it in the. You ocean. watched yeah. Titanic. Does she not die at the end of the movie? The okay. old lady dies. Yes, I don't the old think lady she died. dies. Okay. I don't think she did. Sky, are you shooting? Are you shooting day a Titanic movie? Where is he? What? Listen. I'm asking you, did the old lady die? I don't in the think end? she died in the movie. Y'all. Yeah, she died. No, she didn't. Yeah. She threw the blue crystal down into the ocean. Yes, and she died. And, and she then went, she went to sleep. And then she went to sleep. She didn't get up. She, she didn't went to sleep. sleep. She didn't get up. She didn't get up. She went she went she didn't get up. She, she died. Yes, yeah, she told the story. She died. She told the story. So how did she die? She told the story. She died. She died yeah. at the end. At the very end. And yes, the very end. Remember she left her granddaughter or whatever and the fucking kid? She died. See, she dies. I don't remember Rose dying. Yeah. I don't. I don't remember her dying. Rose died. She goes to sleep, which is like you know a metaphor. I wonder what happened to her husband. No, so it was a metaphor. We don't know if she really died or not. No, I think okay, she let's, died. Let's call James Cameron. No, she died. She died towards the end. Yeah, she's she's gone. Well, like it's knowledge. Everybody yeah. knows that just, she died. Just let's just say <laughs> no, right still alive. Hey, old lady, at the end of Titanic, resting peacefully. Your story inspired us to do a part two. We just trying to figure out how we can bring Jack back. All right? Stay tipsy. Amen. Okay. <laughs> Everyone dies eventually. You're right about that, Arkansas. Yeah, she died in sleep. Yeah. Unless, unless AI oh, makes shit. it so everyone doesn't die. Oh, shit. That can, that can be fun. That can be fun. Okay, so it's largely interpreted as her death. Yes. Yes. Uh, but I did not interpret it as her death. I interpret it as an old lady. You don't interpret shit. Going to sleep. <laughs> okay? You're not interpreting shit. You just see stuff and you're like, okay. You don't ask these questions. She okay? did not die, y'all. Okay? Of course, lady in my sleep. mind, she ain't dead. She went to, she went <laughs> to, <laughs> she, she went to sleep the big sleep. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, that door sold for $718,000, okay? Just so you all know. By the way, by the way, okay. Almost a million dollars. Let me give you all some advice, okay, about stuff. When you'll see Trump selling stuff like his sneakers and shit like that, buy those, <laughs> okay. Now I know y'all. Some of y'all will be going, Sky. I'm not giving a that dude a dime. No, it's not about that. He has some really fanatical fans, okay. And he's gonna go down in history as the most controversial president fucking ever, okay. So all these little tidbits and shit that he was selling, all the little garbage that he, you know, Trump straws and shoes the and all America the bullshit, all the, all the kind of stuff, at some point can be worth a lot of money, you know? Hmm. Not for you, and not for maybe your kids, but your grandkids could definitely cash in, you know, some Trump sneakers, okay? <laughs> that is wild. Yeah. There's a, because he auctioned off a pair at, the, at this, at the... How much did they sell for and the ones that Trump signed, that the were gold auction, ones, yeah, they were they were for like nine grand. We got a super chat from Bambi. Hey, Bambi, Bambi, what's up, girl? Thank you all so much for my drink. Can you tell I'm surrounded rich old man by the drink? <laughs> yes, Bambi, I can tell. Bambi, teach me your ways, so I, I can be surrounded by rich I old men. I told you how to pick a rich dude. But your your theory requires me spending money. But you won't do any nothing for free. Hmm. Nothing. Is this show for free? Okay, like we try to build a streaming show, right? We have to buy food. We have to buy drinks. Then for free. Strong says she didn't die. Hmm. What's between you and Strong? And then y'all can sit there holding hands, talking about how she's still alive. Okay. <laughs> Playing tennis somewhere. All right. <laughs> I don't know why she didn't sell that chain, sell those diamonds, or give it to she her daughter. She threw that thing in the ocean. That upset me. Yeah. But to each their own. Every time a person refers to a rapper or a celebrity as an authoritative source of information, my butt cringes a little. Your butt? Which one are you talking about, 630? Oh, I guess he's he talking about He doesn't own Trump. a sneaker brand. It's a company that made them with his name on them. Yeah, I know. I know. That's what he always does. That's what he always does. He licenses his name, right? But my point is, Trump. those sneakers will be worth something at some point. 
Okay? Because you got to feel, his hardcore fans can put him on day one. They can fuck him up, right? Mm -hmm. Actually, I, who knows how much he make it? He might have made two million of these. Who knows? But this is probably a limited edition run. And so a lot of them going to be lost, destroyed over time. So you just hang on to yours. Don't wear them. And even better, if you can get him to sign them, go to his rally in the front. Hey, Mr. Trump, Mr. Trump, I love you so much. Please sign these. Or okay. you can just fake his signature, right? No. How can you fake his signature? So then people think when you're so, what, ready to sell them 50 years from now that he signed them. Yeah, but you just devalued the fucking thing with a fake signature. But how are they going to know if it's fake? Because you could tell if shit's fake or real. They have, they have entire fields of study based on that, like verifying signatures. And your bullshit fake Trump signature is not going to look good. Mm -hmm. So just let him sign it if you can get him to do that. I suppose. Yeah. <laughs> Arkansas, they, they're ugly as fuck. They are. But my point is... They will be worth money if if you into if you into that kind of if you into making money like that that kind of paraphernalia, just save them, okay? And, okay. and you'll be good. Okay. Yeah. You know Sounds what I mean? good. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. So guys, what drink we making for you all? Since Shayla just chugged that. Uh uh. Somebody said, don't invest in the Trump limited edition crap. Invest in comic books. Comic books are good too. Really? Comic. I mean, comic books. You kind of have to know books? what you're doing. Yeah, you got. Yeah. And you got to keep them a long time. Comic books are uh, still like a yeah, investment com type thing, like Pokemon cards. Pokemon cards, comic books, baseball cards, basketball cards—all these things have. People still care about baseball cards. Why wouldn't they care about baseball cards? Though? I don't know. Like, dude, if you have like if you have cards, I mean, all all these things are all these things are go. Bops was horrible. Are they talking about the movie that you mentioned earlier, Bops? That was so old. Yeah. It's a good Let one. me get one of them tacos. Oh boy, you could have some of these tacos. Oh, DJ Bozak. DJ Bozak's in the house. Up. Stop coming late. Bozak, what drink you want to see? We make it, we make it. We trying to come up with a final drink here. Hold on, should we even? Sheila, let's do this. Sheila, hmm. watch out. Yes, sir. Let's oh. work on this. You want to? Now guys, here's the thing with this drink. It ain't ready. No, because all the liquor hasn't gone in. That'll take, that, could take, that, that could take like a day or two. But some of it's gone But we're going to do this every day, so why don't we wait? That's, that's okay. We could, we could do this one now. Okay. So let's, let's do it. Because some people might only see this episode. Okay. Pull out. So the watermelon is now infused with... Some of it. Some of it. Zinfandel. Some of it, some of it went in. Some of it went in. Okay. Some of it went in. Not much, but some of it went in. That one was stuffed in there real good. Mm -hmm. We got another super chat from Big C Boogie. Thank you so much. Big C Buggy? Buggy, sorry. Yes, All right. Uh, oop. All right. All right, so let's put this on the side. Get my knife. Watch out. Okay. Are right, you coming close? Perfect. So let's come in here and let's cut this. You could see, so where the liquor starts going in, you could see like it turns red around areas where, where there's a lot of booze. So if I wanted boozy watermelon at my um, function, mm -hmm. I could just do this the night before. Mm -hmm. Yes, you can. Would you recommend doing this with like a bottle of vodka? Yes, you can. It would still be good? Vodka's the original. This, was, this is vodka watermelon. This is how it's done. Ooh, be careful. Ooh, you scare me. But we've taken it in a different direction. Dun, 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 dun. Shayla, ladies and gentlemen. This tell is beautiful. You, tell me if you taste any wine on that. I've never seen such a beautifully cut piece tell of Tell me if you taste any wine on that homeboy. I do a little bit. What's it taste like? It's very slight. What's it taste like? It tastes a little boozy.
since we got it, right? Mm -hmm. It's a little boozy. Sketchy. With the knife? Mm hmm. How? Big ass knife. How is it sketchy? Give me a knife like a bomb bag. Watch out. That's gonna be really delicious. With this? This jar, yeah. I can take it home? Probably, if you want it. I mean, it's gonna have a bunch of seeds and stuff in it, but you could see that, right? Mm-hmm. Nothing a little um, strainer won't fix. Mm -hmm. You remember, you remember the, the la, um, so last week we did an episode where we talked about, um, or week before last, we talked about how OnlyFans girls were struggling with boyfriends because, um, you with, know. With getting boyfriends? Yeah. You remember that? Okay. Do you remember that? You recall us discussing Kind of, that? yeah. A little bit. So one of the girls from the episode, from that, that news article, uh -huh. she contacted me, so. Really? We can interview her a little bit. Maybe tomorrow if she calls wow. me. Okay, so now we're coming behind us with a little bit of vodka. And let's go in there. Let's hit it with a little bit of, let's go triple set. Triple set for Pete Snaps. Wait, wait, triple. Who, who are you talking about? What We did an episode where we talk about how OnlyFans girls were struggling to oh, find yeah, boyfriends. Yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah, so one of the girls contacted me after seeing my piece on that. And mm -hmm. so she's gonna call in tomorrow. Oh, okay, she's German, cool. by the way. Oh, she's German. Okay. You, gonna, you, can, you gonna talk to her? We're we gonna be a triple sec. We're okay, going triple sec or, or? Let's do triple sec. Go ahead, pour it in. Okay. Don't let the, the point touch. You understand that? Did I? Yeah. That was an accident. Some might taste like shit though, but try it. I don't think it will. Try it. Drink, drink from the bowl. I don't think it'll taste like. It's strong. It's good. What, the wine? It's wine. The wines? You only taste wine, right? I can really only taste the wine, but it's like very forward. Wine forward. Mm -hmm. Which makes sense. He poured four bottles in there. I don't really taste the vodka that much. What if you put in like this much, this much wine, maybe some sweet and sour and the vodka? What oh wow, think? that'd be really good, huh? Yeah. But totally this is fine. We can do that tomorrow. You could totally make that work, yeah. We can try it tomorrow. Yeah, homeboy. Okay guys, so let's look at what we made today. We made some of this. Okay, this is our wine watermelon thingy. We made our aviation that they kind of finished. We made this blue margarita thing. We made a sky juice, okay. We cook our uh, smashed tacos. A few of them. And then we also made a, what you call it, a alien brain hemorrhage. Oh yeah, we did. Then we did a lot. Guys, five, five especially three. all you Facebookers in here, the main stream for the show is on YouTube. YouTube.com slash tipsy bartender. Okay, that's where the main stream is. What's up, uh, Ty Die Lurker? That's where the main stream is, right? <laughs> Excuse me. Bless you. Bless you. Okay, and that's where we want you to follow us. Come over to YouTube so that you become a member and support the show. Help us buy booze. Also, you can make donations, okay, to buy booze. And the Facebook feed disappears anyway because Facebook always blocking us, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? That's why, we, that's why this turned out to be kind of a YouTube show, mm -hmm. okay? So please come over and support us. We can be here tomorrow again, 5.30 Eastern Standard Time, 2.30 Pacific Standard Time. We can make some cool shit, okay? What you say we're trying to make tomorrow? Let's do this with the, um... With sweet and sour? Mm-hmm. Okay. So save these watermelons. Well, I wouldn't use these. I'd use a different watermelon. A whole new watermelon? They, I mean, look at they look. They look like they've been shot. A whole new watermelon. Okay. You know what I mean? I suppose. Yeah, hey, so see y'all manana. Drink responsibly. 
Don't, Don't drink, drink and drive. drive. Stay, Stay tipsy. tipsy. Oh boy, that's what I'm talking about. Adios, mi gente. Nos vemos. Swear to go. Well done. You have no idea what you're saying, eh? I <laughs>